now live what is up everybody welcome back to the channel and welcome to feeding frenzy 2 rise to the top so you might be saying oh no Kess, why are you in a four by three aspect ratio why do you have black bars on your screen Kess? and the reason yes i did start the stream with the annoying voice the reason why we have the black bars is because um this game will not run with widescreen okay it's not like feeding frenzy one with feeding frenzy one i could use the dg voodoo 2 mod to kind of like fix it so it had widescreen support i tried to do it with this game um and it wouldn't work it just would not like it would make the game widescreen but as soon as i would open the game and actually try to start playing it the fish would always trail off to the left and you could never actually move it it just some reason it just screwed up where it thought the cursor was so yeah it's a shame, but uh, yeah, we're gonna have to run this native resolution. Really not that big of a deal, but uh, yeah, it's gonna be a fun stream. Gonna be doing some feeding frenzy too. It's gonna be fun. It's a late night stream with Cass and uh, all that good stuff. But welcome, welcome everybody. Thank you all so much for taking the wonderful time out of your day to watch your boy. I appreciate you all, and I'm really, really sorry that I made you wait for the stream. I really didn't want to, but I was really hungry, and I just needed a little bit of food before I thought I'd get stream. I do have some tea, so we're gonna chill, we're gonna have some fun, and uh, yeah, it's gonna be great. Mm. Mm. All right, Real Tide said, uh-huh, sure, one minute. Yeah, I deserve that. Super Cool Meme says, that was me when I realized Halo 6 was not coming on 2020, cause 343 knows their games suck, so it is taking a long time. Flashback to five minutes ago when he said that. Oh no. Well, I have a random thought that is lyrics, that is a do 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 pancakes pancakes okay max cat jeff your personality is basically just r slash i had a stroke and then that's it right no no nah, i'm teasing all right not really anyway kiss lied it wasn't a minute it was okay but yeah welcome max cat anyway it's like the 90s again i just need one of those big tvs late night stream with your mom oh oh that's a that's a good one boy that's a bloody stinking good one Guys, I want Feeding Frenzy 3. Me too, super cool meme. I also want Feeding Frenzy 3. Dude, for real though. Alright guys, so this is the game. Uh, welcome back test. Oh, you can't you can't see that. You can't see the test thing, because my web can cover, cover it. Well, this is the profile name. See, test. That was something I made to actually test the game to make sure it was running. Ah! There's a fly trying to get my face. Anyway, I'm going to make a new profile. Cass, get... Gamey. Kess Gamey. There we go. Yes, yeah, so your boy Kess Gamey is, uh, I'm gonna do that just to trigger people. Kess Gamey, we're gonna do, uh, we're gonna do both two campaign run-throughs tonight. We're gonna do the regular campaign, then we're gonna do it in time attack mode. It's gonna be fun. I think this one's a little bit more advanced than the first game. Like, the first game was fun and everything, but like so many games often are, the sequel is much, much better. So, let's go ahead and play. But yeah, this is, this is like a game I played as a childhood. Loved this game, loved it to death. It was so fun. So yeah, meet Boris the butterfly fish. Boris lives, it might just be nostalgia talking. Boris lives in the warm waters of the Sandy Shoal, a beautiful area off the Frenzy Coast. Enjoy, enjoy the sights, but don't get too comfortable. A fish still needs his lunch, and it's a fish eat fish world out there. Warm up those choppers and have some fun. Let's do it. All right, guy with no name. Says nostalgia, welcome guy with no name. Oh, and look at the frame rate, guys. Look how smooth the frame rate is. For some reason, Feeding Frenzy 1 felt like the frame rate was like capped at like 30 or something, but this one just feels so smooth. Like it, I know like you guys are only seeing it like 60 FPS because that's what YouTube's streaming limit is, but like I'm, I'm playing it on like a 144 FPS monitor, right? And like, you know, 144 hertz refresh rate, and it just looks, it looks so good. It just looks so amazing. I'm the, I'm the big fishy now. They called me. Big fishy man back in kindergarten. I hope they didn't call me that. That'd be horrifying. Okay. Give me a little crunchy. Little crunchy man. Thank you. Alright. I don't think my mermaid friend is in this is in this game. She is though! Never mind, I was wrong. It's my mermaid friend. Hooray! I was worried she wasn't gonna be in the game. Cause she was in the first one and she was great. Okay. I want a super cool meme. And a little cast gave me. I got petition to to cast to rename his channel to cast gamey no no ill sign super cool meme says uh since ea owns cap 
Cap Cop. Do you mean Pop Cap? Um, if they make Frenzy 3, it will cost five ninety nine to get. Yeah, it will. You would be right. Uh, fun fact, puffer fish are greedy. Supposedly, if a lot of food is available, puffer fish will eat until it seems nearly stunned. <laughs> That's funny. That is hilarious. Watch for starfish. Tasty starfish have been floating around these parts. Grab a starfish bubble for some extra points. They won't help Boris get any bigger, but they sure grow your size. They sure grow your size. Guys. Uh. Anyway. Uh, and then there was instructions to dash. I know how to dash. You you left quick. See? Dash. Very useful when you're trying to escape or catch something. Like when you get to the part with the golden minnow, which is what you eat and you'll grow like one size bigger instantly. And if you're in the final size, you'll like finish the level. Right? It's, uh, it's kind of like that. It's like that's what, something you want to use for that. I don't know how else I could possibly say it. But yeah, I love feeding friends. Like, look at the environment. Like, like, it's just so it's just so relaxing. You know what I mean? The music is relaxing. The background is relaxing. It's just you know, it's just so chill. It's just so, you know, it's late at night. It's just a chill old stream. And there's Big Shark Man. All right, you can you can buy his merchandise at BigSharkMan.com. <laughs> okay. All right. Oh man. All right. Oh man. I want another chicken pot pie now, but the store is closed. That sucks. Okay. Anyway, um, I was about to say I want a Dead Rising Battlefield Need for Speed Sims crossover. Oh, that would be amazing. Real time's like, no, please no. <laughs> uh, so, oh, not PopCap. You said Capcom. Oh, okay. That makes more sense. I'll die at the end with Capcom. I don't think they do, no. But they do on PopCap. Okay. You want a Halo with a crossing with a Doom game? That would be cool. I'd, I'd like to see that. It would be amazing. It would. Brett Alt, welcome, buddy. He says, hi, guys. I'm watching via mobile phone tonight. Okay, cool, dude. Cool. How's that, how's that going for you? You got a good mobile phone experience? So, <laughs> I hope. Uh, jellyfish is 98% water. Really? Wow. That's kind of cool. Frenzy time. Mm, excuse me. Now that you're warmed up, it's time to get your frenzy on. Woohoo! Okay, now, eat fish, quickly fill up the frenzy meter. Each time you fill the meter, your frenzy multiplier increases and everything you eat is worth more points. Trying to read, and we gotta get big points so we can top the scoreboards and all that crap. Okay, try to reach mega frenzy for a six times bonus. Sweet. Look out for special frenzy boost power-ups. Eat a frenzy booster to fill up the frenzy meter in a single chomp. You have to keep beating to keep to keep the frenzy meter full. Cool, let's do it. All right, maximum H2O Shadow Sam, welcome. He says hello. Hope you're having a good night. I am, buddy, because I'm here streaming with all of you guys, all my awesome friends. Okay, I like food way too much. Well, we I know, right? Do Do you know what is like the one of the most pleasurable experiences of my life? was eat that was a bad choice of words. It was it was eating, drinking, and vaping like Delta 8 at the same exact time. It was just ah ah euphoric or whatever the stink that word is. Mm. Mm. Oh that's the best tea ever. Ah oh, it's really not, but it's good. It's really good. Okay. Sorry I was thinking of pop cap and cops when I said the EA thing. That's funny dude. Amos Arnett says hi again. Welcome Amos Welcome to the stream, dude. It's good to have you here. We're doing some Feeding Frenzy 2. We did Feeding Frenzy 1 last Saturday. And today we're gonna be doing the sequel. These are games uh, I played when I was a kid. I thought they'd make for like fun little short game series on the channel. So that's what we'd be doing tonight. Go ahead and take that dude out. Hey there, little buddy. What's good? What happened? And do this. Oh, oh, big man on campus now. Okay, that that was a weird thing to say. Okay, I'm gonna go over here. Hey, buddy, what's good? Oh no, oh no no no. Oh, okay, there we go. There's only the little minnows now. I need I need I need big medium fishish. There we go. Nice. Okay, got to get the feeding frenzy meter combo to stay up. Go ahead and rush around everywhere. All right, where's my mermaid friend? There she is. Okay. 
Sweet. Time we do it. Is that a wine glass kiss? Um, you know what, dude? This is actually was my great grandmother's glasses, if I remember correctly. Maybe. No. Was that part of a dish set? No, I think that was just the plates. Never mind. So, well, maybe it was. I don't know. I don't actually know. I know some of the dishes she gave me. Anyway, um, no. I, I mean, I guess this is a stem glass. I guess you could put wine in it. I mean, I don't drink wine. I'm not really like a much of an alcohol person. Um, I did try tequila shots, though. Those those were... those Tequila is nasty. It tastes like hair tonics. So you, like, want to chase it with some orange juice. Anyway, uh, this is tea, dude. You know me. Really like tea. You know, and all that. Okay. Uh, I have a decent connection. Let's see how many. That's what she said jokes. We can knock off out of the park tonight. Uh, are we going to drink some wine? No. No. Okay. All right. Um, anyway, feeling a lot of mom jokes tonight. You're feeling a lot of mom jokes tonight. Okay. Well, we keep your hands to yourself, please. Okay. Anyway. All right. Uh, Tropical Dark. Welcome. He says, yo, Cass, I watched the saddest video. I'm sorry to hear that, Tropical. Maybe I'm not. Maybe you wanted to feel sad. That makes sense. Okay, barracudas have sharp teeth that can shred nearly any fish they catch. See, that's sad. There you go. Just lots and lots of fish getting continuously shredded. Very sad. Big tragedy. Okay, your mom can feel... Oh, please, no, real tide. Okay. Every time Cass says, you know what, I get Thunderstruck flashbacks. Uh, for airing herring or herder. That's a weird thing to say. Bonus stage. Okay. Act fast. What's this? You seem to have stumbled on a whole school of herring. No, with no predators in sight. Better act fast. Eat as many fish as you can in one minute. Eat all 100 fish for a time around you have to rack up a time bullshit at the end of the stage. Don't worry if you don't finish. It's a bonus stage. It's always good, but never bad. That's what I expected of you. Okay. All right. Hold up. Hold up. All right, guys. Bonus stage. Let's go. Let's bloody go, son. All right. Big herring. Big herring time. Oh, man. This game is nostalgic. Can we get a GG for the feeding frenzy in the chat? Maybe not. Okay. All right. Here. We can totally do this, though. See, we're already halfway there. Only got 40 seconds, though. Oh, man. I went hiking with my brother a couple of days ago, and we went to went to a bluff. I, I posted a picture in the Discord. I don't know if you guys saw it. It was me. It's like a, a great view of, like, a valley in the background. Um, that was me going, like, hiking with my bro, right? Went to this bluff. It was on a mountain. Had a beautiful view of the valley where our town is. And, uh, yeah. And so I did that, and it was great. It was amazing. It was beautiful. But uh, we got tick for a... Uh, um, tick medicine relief. Yes, please. Yeah, big, big money. Oh, no, wait a minute. Are we having connection issues? YouTube's, YouTube's telling me we're having connection issues. No, YouTube, no. No, bad. Bad YouTube. Don't have connection issues. Guys, do we have connection issues? I can't tell if we did or not or if that was just on my end. It looked like we were. So if not, let me know, but okay. I, I Earlier, the other day, it just was like... Showing some weird thing, and like people are starting to say they couldn't see the stream, so I'm I got annoyed. Okay. All right, anyway, let's continue, shall we? Um, da da da. Because drinking wine is like me going with the night without saying that's what she said. It's impossible, it never happens. I mean, I have drank wine, I just don't care for it. Okay. Um, da da da. The guy collected mugs for 35 years, and he showed them to the world, and he got his first mug. And the big microphone dropped down, all the mugs, 35 years gone, left with the first, though. Oh, well, that's a shame. I'm sorry to hear that. Okay. Uh, it suffered a bit at Buffered. That's weird. I wonder why we've been having so many problems lately. Like, it just seems lately we've just seemed to have had, like, just these weird issues with just little connection hiccups and stuff along the way. And I'm, I really wonder what's going on. It's like, we were good for a while, but lately it just seems like there's just... Something coming between us. You know what I'm. You know what I'm saying, guys. Did buffer a little bit. Okay. Well, I'm sorry about that lag, but it stopped. Okay. All right. Well, I am sorry about that, guys. Okay. <clears throat> anyway, uninvited guests. What are they doing here? What's going on? These humphead rats don't usually venture in this close to the coast. This friendly little shoal is getting a bit crowded. 
Extra lives, be on the lookout for 1-Up Bubbles, eat a 1-Up Bubble to earn an extra life. You might not need them now, but you never know what danger lurks around the corner. Watch for 1-Up Bubbles, the more lives the better. Woo, okay. Alright, so, we're looking for the little red and orange fishies. That's what we do. Eating frenzy. Frenzy. Here we go. Triple frenzy. Super frenzy. Mega frenzy. Okay, so the big ones from the last time are now the medium ones. Another one up. I guess that adds lives, right? Probably. Nice. Ah. Very relaxing game, just the water sounds and the music. I don't like the way I said that. Anyway. Mega frenzy. Okay. Um, let's see. Da -da. I wouldn't be surprised with potential severe storms or any storms coming from my area tonight. With buffers on my end. Okay. Hmm. Your mom, just kidding. <laughs> okay. Let's see, when inflate, a puffer fish's stomach increases to nearly 100 times its original volume. That is fascinating. Ah! Because mobile devices and severe thunderstorms, you never know if you get my drift. Oh yeah, with towers getting knocked out, I totally get you. With all these new guests in the Sandy Shoal, it's time to start heading towards some shallower waters. Maybe things will be a little more peaceful down in Paradise Reef. Maybe we'll all die forever. Okay, no. Tricky treasure. Sometimes oysters open to reveal hidden treasures. Grab them quickly before they close, or you'll be caught in the act. Hint. Oysters shake a little just before they shut. Here's the thing, okay? Okay, fam? I'm not some bloody new. Like, I get that this game was more popular than Feeding Frenzy 1, and that way more people played Feeding Frenzy 2 before... Or, I'm sorry, more way more people played this game than they played the first one. But you have to understand... The first one was far more hardcore. It was m hardcore, okay? And that one, the clams didn't give you any indicator of when they'd, they'd shut, okay? And wait, when you got later into the game, the time amount between when they'd be open and closed was even less. I didn't have none of this, we didn't have none of this shaking crap back in my day in Feeding Frenzy 1, okay? This is easy. This is easy, son. This is like no man's sky difficulty. I don't even know what the hell I'm talking about. Mermaid girl, woo! Let's go, let's go! Okay, we'll do that again next Saturday. Eh. Mm. Okay, your ISP hates you for some reason. Yeah, I know, right? And they're always so nice to me, so I don't know why. Um, but yeah, what YouTube is doing while buffering. Yes, exactly real tight. Okay, I wear a mask with a sus smile and I say I'm just fish shish. That's, 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 mmm. Your mom's difficult. Oh, okay. That's fair. That's fair, Willie. Wow, six likes. Thank you, guys. Mm. All right. The simple-looking brain coral extends hundreds of stinging tentacles at night to catch small prey. Tang. Oh, man. Ooh, speaking of bugs, bugs for dinner. Look at all those tasty bugs. The pier is a great place to catch some snacks, but you're going to have to work for it. This was so much made the game so much more fun. That's, again, another reason why this was far more interesting than Feeding Frenzy 1. Try to catch all the bugs on the level before the time runs out. Oh, this is a timer one. Uh, swim towards water surface. When you're right at the surface, click the left mouse button. The faster you're moving, the higher you'll jump. Click the mouse button and there, do a flip. Flips earn your style points, but only if you finish the flip before you hit the water. Try to eat all the bugs before the timer runs out. So yeah, pretty good stuff. Woo! And see, you get a jump height bonus. Personal best. See, and those give you extra points. It's it's pretty cool. It's pretty cool, guys. You get the... But see, if you do that, you get a belly flop. And nobody wants a belly flop. All right, I need to get more bugs. Okay, need to munch more. There's another one. Woo! Let's go. Okay. All right, anyway. The legend himself, Tropical Dark, says die in battle, in phone, in toilet. I know, right? Gosh dang it, Willie. Says real tight. Your mom's difficult. That sounds about right. I tried taking her off to dinner last night in a disaster. I'm sure it sure it did, Brad. can only imagine. A leopard shark's taking up residence under the pier. What's he doing here? 
Something strange must be going on to cause all this commotion. Keep your eyes peeled for anything out of the ordinary and make sure to avoid that shark. If I died again, I don't think I have. I'm like doing a personal best. Why is everyone so grumpy? Anyway, uh, if you ever forget which fish are small enough to eat, make sure to check the menu at the top. Okay, I think, I don't think I'm gonna forget which fish are small enough, okay? Okay, is that guy small enough? Probably not, given he's about four times my size. Oh, I hope I don't forget that. What's with the music? Oh, it's cause the shark. Oh, see, he just, he just, he just chows down. He don't give a stink what size he is. Okay, this music is actually kind of stressing me out right now. It sounds way more stressful than it really needs to be if we're being completely honest. Oh, we can get bugs at the same time. I forgot about that. That works out nicely. Let me just chill up here for a bit, get some bugs. Oh wait, I can get medium fish now. In that case, we'll focus on that. Yeah, I'm surprised they didn't come out with more of these because this was fairly popular for, you know, for this type of game, for this type of like casual sort of game. A lot of people like these. No! Okay. Uh, well, that was sad, guys. We unfortunately ended our no, no death streak. I'm not even going to try to make an excuse to say it was just it, me showing you what not to do. I'm not even going to go there. I, I'd like to, but... I can't lie to you all. Not today. Wait, what? See, there's a story in this one. I love the music. It's great. Tuna can swim up to 50 miles per hour. Cool. Listen to the music, guys. It's like TF2 on Halloween. That food filled a hole. Oh no, Willie, please no. Uh, okay. Okay. Um, anyway, your cat is oddly looking at the mirror or the tissue box. Well, smack it upside the head. I don't know what the stink am I supposed to say to that. Guess I invite you to funeral of my phone died in toilet world to rip and y'all. I'm not going to a funeral for your toilet phone, Tropical Dark. No clip. Nobody clip that. Okay. Um, that wouldn't be the first time Lily says Brad, uh, super cool meme says are you a creepy man named John the Baptist? What why would that be creepy? That's that's not a creepy name. John the Baptist was cool. Congratulations, you've reached Paradise Reef. Rumors have spread about the mysterious creature that Boris spotted on his way here. Layla, the resident queen at Triggerfish, has decided to investigate. Maybe the appearance of this stranger has something to do with everyone's nasty mood. Okay, so so basically the big the big shadow dude is the one who's like sending sharks over here where they don't belong and crap. Mm. And now we can suck up fish like a vacuum, so that's fine. But it's but not every time, unfortunately. Nice, we got the school bonus. We got the school bonus, guys. Let's go. Can I get the pearl thing? Is there a pearl thing? No. Sad cast. No pearl things. For Ooh! Black pearl. Let's go. Let's bloody go, guys. And now we're medium size. And there's a lot of big ones and not very many medium ones, unfortunately. Okay. That's okay, though. We get the big ones now. Woo! There we go. Mermaid friends back. Mega frenzy. Hooray. Okay. Ronan, welcome. He says, also, Cash, are you okay? Your eyes are bloodshot. Hey, Ronan, welcome, buddy. Yeah, I'm fine, mate. I'm just tired. I probably just need some sleep. It's late here. It's like almost midnight. But uh, we're going to stream before I sleep. So, yeah. Okay. Anyway, but yeah, welcome. Um... Da, da, da. It's work every stream. You ask me if I'm a creepy man. <laughs> <laughs> oh goodness. Oh man, why would you say that though? That's terrible. Yeah, you don't go around on the internet asking people if they're creepy men. <laughs> I can imagine if people did that in real life though. Like they went to a grocery store. Excuse me, are you a creepy man? 
I just want to know where the yogurt is. Okay. The average great white shark is 10 to 15 feet long, while larger specimens can reach 21 feet in length. Okay. All right. Uh, warning. A barracuda has been spotted cruising the reef. Watch for warning signs and keep away from his gaping maw. If you are feeling really lucky, try biting his tail. Bite it four times and you're in for a special surprise if you survive that long. Schools out. Watch for schools of fish. If you eat every fish in a school, then you get big school bonus. Maybe use the right mouse button to inhale. Keep an eye out for barracuda. Blah, blah, blah. Grab all this guy, too. Um, that is not very many people. Goodness. Okay. Wait, what? The quam wasn't shaking. I. So, you know, I can I can get all that stuff. So. Yeah. That's 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 the rule of thumb, guys. You just look for the shaking quam. Anyway. Ooh, crap. Okay. All right. Grab all that. Oh, there's the barracuda. I, I want to try. All right. See. Now he's now he's now he's coming for me. Now he's coming for me. All right. I'm dodging him. I'm do no. I only had to get him one more time. Then he shrinks. And then you can. Then you can. Then you can suck it in. It's. It's really fun. I. I really want to get him. Cause like that's a fun. That's a fun thing to do. To eat a barracuda. It was one of the best additions to feeding frenzy. Two. Because you couldn't do that in feeding frenzy one. But it is a fun. Fun feature. I mean, you sorta could do that in feeding frenzy one, but it wasn't the same. It was nowhere near as cool and skill-based. Oh man, every time. Every time, guys. I almost feel like I don't need to, shouldn't be doing it, but I want to, I want to relearn the skill, you know? I'm all about those skills. Don't want to lose all my lives, though. You know what I mean? That wouldn't be very intelligent. Triple frenzy. Super frenzy. Mega frenzy. See, look, he gets he gets tiny now. Woo! And then you eat him. It's 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 so fun. Oh, I love it. I love eating the barracuda. That's what she said. Okay. Anyway, man, I just want some yogurt. Yes, <laughs> uh, are you a creepy man? Also, where's the milk? Uh, barrack guys. Look guys, I got the barracuda bonus. Oh, I want to print that out and put it on the fridge so grandma can see it when she comes to visit. Oh my gosh. Uh, okay. Imagine telling people they're a creepy man and you say that to a five-year-old. He said, mommy. Okay. Another R slash. I had a stroke personality in the chat. Okay. Fun time Freddy too. Welcome, brother. Uh, I just ate both. I am sus. And guess what? I am. Uh, hello, it is me you're looking for. Oh, wait. Wait a minute. No, I did it wrong. Hello. Is it me you're looking for? Okay. Great white sharks can detect electric fields by using the sensors in their snouts. <laughs> you know what else you can detect? Wait a minute. Fight back. There are lots of big fish around here, but you've hit the power to fight back. The shrink shroom power up gives you the chance to show those big bullies who's boss. Eat a shrink shroom power up to make a burst of magical energy. Magical energy. Ugh. We don't have any shrooms, so I don't think we're gonna get that. Hold up here. Let me get the vape pan. We'll see if we can get, make some magical energy. Okay. Um, shrink any fish that's bigger than you. Once you shrink fish to many size, the predator becomes prey. Shrunk fish aren't very nutritious, but they sure are a lot less dangerous. So, we don't really need to be working on eating the big ones, it's just a defense mechanism, which, you know, I mean, we could eat them, but it's not something we need to focus on, we need to actually eat regular sized fish. Maybe we should just avoid the mushrooms altogether. I've got those skills, you know? <laughs> okay, now nah, I'm teasing. Cash, you sang the song in the right tone, oh my gosh. Oh, really? That's hilarious, because I usually can't sing at all. Cash is about to become high, I'm already high, Lily. How did you not know this? Your mom eats the big one. Oh, no! Mm. 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 Chicken Lord says, dumb game. That's not very nice, Chicken Lord. But fair enough. Alright, I'll bite. What's dumb about it? What do you not like about the game, Chicken Lord? What makes you hate the game the most? 
Let's 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 have it. Let's have that discussion, shall we? Oh, so the fishies actually stay tiny permanently. They're not like, you know, whatever the stink you want to call it. They don't. It's not just temporary. They don't just get bigger with time. At least I don't think they do. I don't remember that happening. That's for sure. Even the big sharks. You can even eat the little shark. Again, doesn't give you much food, but it's 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 fun. And at the end of the day, isn't that all that really matters? Super friends. Everybody's like, no, and it's then it's too late. Okay. All right. Eat the eat the fishies. Eat the and that's only on the bigger fishies, so the medium ones won't shrink anymore now, because I can eat them, which makes sense. No crap. Okay. He does not make peeps high. No, but a Delta 8 pin will. At least it could. Has the potential to. Oh, crap. Man, I am really bad at this. Wow, I'm gonna read the chat for a second. Let's not smoke his magic pen. I'm about to smoke my magic pen. Has high. Nah, just kidding. He's tired. There's a new COVID rank. It's your mom. It looks really easy. It is really easy, Chicken Lord. It's, it's just a very casual little game. It's not skill based. It's just supposed to be relaxing. Do the Outlast series, please. I'm begging you, it's so fun. Maybe we will eventually. But on the terms of style points, the game is amazing. Yeah, it's very visually pleasing. That's kind of what makes it. I mean, the gameplay is nothing to write home about. You know, this isn't like going to be the game you'll want to go back and replay over and over and over again. But, you know, it's fun. Or a time or two. Magic pen time. Okay. Resume the game, shall we? Alright, go ahead and grab that. The sharks are driving me crazy if I'm being completely honest with you all. <laughs> like, I can't even get a... I can't even get a bite in edgewise anymore. There's so many big fishies. Alright. I'm looking for the, uh... Super frenzy. Looking for when frenzy. the clams open back up, too. Or any good sized pearls. There we go. Alright, good stuff, guys. I That was kind of dangerous. The shark actually probably could have gotten me there. I noticed there's about one or two sharks in play at any given moment. There we go. Stage clear. <coughs> Excuse me. Ah. Huh, I thought you're not I thought you're not doing shorts. I don't know what that means. Uh Cap Graz Kid Welcome he says, What's the skill cap and learning curve defeating Frenzy 2? Is the MMR system good? <laughs> ah, good point, dude. Welcome to the stream though, mate. I guess it could be rexing to a degree. I think so. Drug patrol smoking time on stream is one. Oh goodness. Anyway. Oh, okay, black pearls range from gray to black. Some may also contain shades of blue, green, yellow, pink, purple. Okay. What's this? A sunken ship filled with herring. No predators in sight. Sounds like a bonus stage. These herring have banded together into fast, nimble schools. Keep them safe. They're a slippery bunch. Can you catch them all before a minute is up? Good for a boost. Keep an eye out for special boost bubbles. They'll give you a burst of energy that might help you chase down those slippery schools. Try to eat seven herring in one minute. I'm hoping there's a little bonus. Um, time bubbles, cause that's, this is gonna be a challenging task. Eat that many, at, you know, one minute. Like 70, really guys? 70 now. Triple frenzy. Super frenzy. Nice. Nice. Mega frenzy. Nice. Who else? Come on. There we go. GG! Alright, we got him! Ah! Cra Cap Grass says, thank you, you're welcome, dude. Rotet says, Chicken Lord, you know what would be really, what would really calm you down playing Superman 64? We've gotta do Superman 64 on the channel at some point, it just has to happen. Right? 
Outlast, like, around October. It's a scary game. That's why you should do it at that time. Maybe we will. That could be fun. Okay. Uh, da, da, da. Uh, hey, guys. I wish I have no dead time. What does it feel like? I don't know what that means. Okay. Anyway. Uh, what would you rather play Sonic 06 over? Over Chicken Lord? Let's see. Um, oh, Superman 64. Yeah. Yeah, that would be that would be funny. <laughs> okay, I didn't take long for others to discover this morsel-filled wreck. Now it's more crowded in here. The pickings are a little slim. You'll need to find some hearty prey to keep yourself alive. Arr. I don't even know what the hell that was. Keep your eyes peeled for the extremely rare golden herring. Golden herring are extremely difficult to catch, but if you get one, you instantly grow the next size. When food is scarce, it may be the only way to grow. Catch the golden herring to grow quickly. All right, guys. Let's do it now. The golden herring to get big. All right, and not look like a pig. All right, that's that's the deal. That's 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 the dream in life. Like, see, there he is, right there. See, I got him, and now I'm at medium size. Just instantly, just like that. Okay, and now I'm even more so still at medium size. Just like that. Feeding frenzy. Ah, good old feeding frenzy. Woo woo. Triple frenzy. Got extra life. That's always fun. But yeah, so have you guys been enjoying the, uh... The Saturday streams? Yes, no, maybe. You know, the one day of the week we do something that's not Doom. How do you guys feel about that? Pretty good, pretty bad, pretty... Pretty somewhere in the middle. Hold up. I'm just really trying to gauge what people like, you know? Anyway, um, like a nine-year-old, she's younger than me, but why better than me in any game? Hashtag 12-year-old problems. Okay, you played GTA since you were like two? <laughs> really, Lily? That's funny. I don't think I could have even played games when I was two. When did I start playing games? I think I was like four. Okay. Hey, have you ever thought of a podcast? Like, I love your voice so much it puts me to sleep. Oh, that's sweet of you to say, dude. Uh, that would be cool. I actually tried to get my brother um, interested in doing a podcast with me because he's he'd be great. He's the he's funny as stink. He'd be great on podcasts, but we never actually got around to doing it. So, like the idea of Saturday streams. Okay, great. All right, you're enjoying it. Good, good. Yeah, I bet you're better than me at Halo. Me? Probably not, dude. Okay. Anyway, um. Yes, and you're marrying the guy from GTA 2. The guy says mission complete. <laughs> uh, you've never played Halo, Lily? Really? That surprises me. I would have thought you would like Halo. Pacific herring gulp air from the surface, store it in their swim bladders, and expel it as bubbles that other herring can hear. That's really weird. The fish, they're basically using urine bubbles to communicate. The fish use the sound to communicate with one another. Dark. That's truly disgusting. Imagine, imagine students at like one of those prison schools doing that. The shipwreck. Something smells weird. That shipwreck hasn't been here too long. Come to think of it, there have been a lot of sunken ships showing up around Frenzy Coast lately. What could be causing them? Surely not the strange shadow creature. The sightings of the strange sea creature have been remoted from the underseas caves to the east of Paradise Reef. Time to head towards deeper water, see if we can learn anything. It's funny. When I was like seven years old and played this game for the first time, the story captivated me so very much. Was I seven? No, I must have been eight or something, because I didn't learn to read until I was about seven, if I remember correctly. I remember I didn't want to read. It was it was adorable. The reason I didn't want to learn to read, right, is because my 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 parents um, always would read to me a lot growing up, and I didn't want. I was worried that if I learned to read, that they would stop doing that, and I would miss that. I would miss like that that time with them. So, but they told me that wouldn't happen. So then I actually learned to read and very much enjoyed it. Anyway, um, so yeah, let's continue. Okay, so the closest thing I played to Halo is Star Wars Battlefront Two from two thousand five. Cool. Very cool. Nice. Go ahead and vacuum all of these up. 
if we can. Double frenzy. Triple frenzy. Nice. Nice. Oh. But now they're now they're tiny and aren't gonna give me nothing for eating them, which would be sad. I mean, this is mostly just the minnow level for me. I'm not even eating the big fish so much. It's, oh, I almost almost got joinked by that clam. That is a terrifyingly large amount of sharks at the shipwreck, guys. Goodness gracious. Super frenzy. Okay, now it's her by guy best guy. Nico Zenos says Kescast. Kescast? Oh, that's hilarious, dude. Welcome to the stream, Nico Zenos. Hope you're having a good one, buddy. Super frenzy. Doing feeding frenzy too, as you can see. And here's Mermaid Girlfriend. Super woot woot. Frenzy. Woot woot, guys. Can Mega I get a name frenzy. in for the woot woot? That, that doesn't sound right. Alright, anyway. Okay. <clears throat> All right, anyway, I didn't learn to read. Instead, I was 18, just didn't care for it. Really? Willie says, I have Windows 10. I used to play Xbox, though. You moved primarily to PC, haven't you? Super cool, Mimi says, bye. Bedtime for me, guys. All right, super cool. Have a good one, buddy. It was good having you here. I think I'd rather play Spore. You'd rather play Spore than play this, Chicken Word? I've never played Spore. I think I... Wait a minute. I actually might have Spore. You know, if I remember correctly, I know that... Resolution screwed up, but bear with me guys. I might very well have that in my Steam account. Hold up. Oh my gosh, I do. I actually have Spore. Ha! Amazing. Ladies and gentlemen, your boy Cast is owner of Spore on Steam. Amazing. Absolutely amazing. Okay. Alright, now you can read 300 words per minute. Good for you, dude. Tropical Dark says, I'm so mature. <laughs> Alright, anyway, let's continue. Surface interlude. Time for a breath of fresh air before heading out to the deep water caves. More bug catching bonus action. This time with balloons. Ah! Every, ever wonder where balloons go when you let them go? Well, now you know. Uh, watch out for balloon dangling bonus goodies. If you catch a speed power up, try getting some big air. Remember, you can flip while you're in the air by clicking the left mouse button. Try to eat 65 bugs in two minutes. Let's do it. Let's eat some bugs. And then have some hugs. Wait, wait, what? No. No. No, you said that. And... Ah, stink. That's, that's what, that's what's not fun. That's, that's what's not fun, Charlie. Can't you can't be doing mid flip when you hit the water, otherwise you'll get belly flop and then you'll be like sort of just timed down for a second, which is not not fun at all. Oh that was that was oh wow, when you get the when you get the little speed thing, you can jump up real high. Set a new personal bonus for jumping, really. Alright. We've almost got them all, I think. I really hope so. Woo! Personal best, let's go. Okay, that was worth it, because we got that one. We don't have that many left, but we only have a minute left. Hold up. Hold up, nice. Okay. Let's see. Oh, come on. Oh, man, this is hard to control when it's up in the air like that. Oh, stink. I forgot how hard this level is. Okay. Revenge of the Butterflies. That's that's what this game. That's what the, this is what feeding frenzy three should be called. It should just be a spy, an action spy game, and it should be called feeding frenzy three. Revenge of the butterflies, starring Kes Gaming. When like I'm, and there's there's voice acting in it, and I'm the and the voice of the of the, of the fish. And there doesn't change fish agents this time. They just die, you know. Like it, and then it changes, but it's like the same voice, and it's and it's me. Mm. Anyway. Yeah, uh, okay. You play a PC and PS5? That's cool, dude. You had it on Steam to try it out, but you wanted a different game with your Steam money, so you refunded it. Interesting. 
A fish eating birds is terrifying. I know, right? But technically, later, there's a seagull, and you can shrink him down with a magic mushroom and eat him. Well, he's not a seagull. He's a pelican. So, technically, yeah, we could do that. Uh, explore for Saturday stream? Uh, I don't know. Maybe. Maybe. I'll look into it. We could possibly do that. Cast do Just Dance series? That would be cool. We get copyright claim. Well, who cares? So, we get that on GTA, and I don't really give a crap. Yeah. Yeah, we could totally do a Just Dance series. I'd have to get a equipment for it, though. Isn't that like something where you have to have... I know that for sure it's not on PC. Isn't that like something you have to have, like, a motion sensing camera or something for, I think? Probably, yeah. I'd get a Wii. We could play it on that. So, I'd get a Wii really cheap. Those have great motion sensors. So, usually, like, well... I mean, it's motion controls. It's like, how great is it really? But, but, but better than what you have on Xbox or PlayStation. Anyway, but then again, I have a I have a PlayStation 4 and I could just get a PlayStation carry. I don't care. Is this another shipwreck blocking the way down to Hunter's Cavern? Yes. It must have just sunk because there seems to be a bunch of live mines floating around here. All the more reason to try to track down what's causing all these wrecks. It's getting dangerous for the local sea life. Uh, danger mines. Avoid them. If they fall from the top of the screen, if you bump into one of them, kaboom, stick with it. You're almost to Hunter's Cavern. I'm so glad we're almost to Hunter's Cavern, guys. Oh, st oh, oh, okay. Well, this, well, the mushroom thing, here's, a, here's an important question. Will mushroom things shrink the bombs and make them smaller? Because I feel like that would make them more easier to hit instead of harder to hit. I probably didn't say that right. Who cares? All right, anyway. Okay, now I want to see Kes do a Fortnite dance. <laughs> Mr. Hack, coming in with a dab. Welcome, Mr. Hack. Oh, no. I forgot you could vacuum suck those towards you. That's that's never pleasant. That is very almost never pleasant. Okay. Wait. Almost never. What was the almost? Never mind. Okay, oh, he's going to hit it. Yep, no more blue fish. I wrote a little song about it called No More Blue Fish. Does anyone want to hear my song? Anybody at all? Uh Oh no, I hit the thing, and so did Mr. Sharkface. Okay, well, no more Mr. Sharkface, but hey, at least I got big first. That's, that's what she said. Okay. We end on PS4, cool. Ooh, more mysterious sightings. Let's go, more mysterious music. Here we go. Here we go. Oh. Anyway. All right, okay. Pick up a Wii U if you ever see one for like 80 bucks or less, it's worth it. Okay, cool, thanks. Wago controls paired with infrared pointers actually offer less control of the PS3 or 360 options. Um, I Yes, I know Chicken Lord. I know the controller is not as good. I'm just saying the camera technology in those systems is better. You have the covers of this game? Me too. It's just very, it's just very relaxing and just vibrant or something. I don't know. I just like it. Expecting to see a pineapple under the sea. I agree. Yeah, it does. It's like, it, I agree. It has the same sort of SpongeBob visuals. Maybe that's why it's so satisfying. When it come out, uh, 2006. However, attachments you can get for the Wiimote to give it true motion. Cool. Very cool. Young African Pompanos stay in shallow reef areas while adults can be found around deep shipwrecks. Well, we have 12 likes now. Thank you guys. I appreciate that. Didn't I just say it was six likes a little while ago? Thank you. Okay, Wayless Hunch was right. Congratulations, you beat Hunter's Caverns. Wayless Hunch was right. The Shadow Sea creature was headed towards Hunter's Cavern. Now that she tracked him down, it's time to let some local talent take over. These caves are dark and dangerous, but Eddie the Angler will light the way. Woo! Deep water jellyfish live in these caves, trying to touch them. If you get too close, their poisonous sting will stun you for a few seconds. Lucky thing is, they will stun predators as well. Keep an eye out for stun stunning jellyfish. Okay, go ahead and, oh, I didn't get eaten by that for some reason. Look at these caves, though. Ah, oh. oh, yeah. Oh, man, the, the visuals and the colors just speak to me, guys. They're just like, look, Cassie boy, it's me, the visual colors. And then that's it. And then that's it. That's what she said. <laughs> All right. Okay. Um, anyway. I'll use the, just use the dolphin emulator for Wii games. That's right, you do have the dolphin emulator. You have seen you for Wii U and um, emulation too. 
There are more modern Wiimotes that come with that technology out of the box. Just look for Motion Plus Wiimotes. Oh, really? Oh, that's cool. Okay. I could guess. I guess I could just get like that bar and hook it up to my PC, run Dolphin, and then just get one of those Wii Plus modes. I'd probably be all good to go. So that would be kind of neat. We could do some. We could do some cool little series on that. Okay. Oh wait, I can have medium ones now. I forgot. That was a silly thing to do. Okay, the jellyfish are a bit of a pain. But I suppose necessary for sea life. Why necessary, you might ask? Well, I don't know. But I'm just gonna go with it, the fact that they are. Okay, eat all these. Anyone else? Oh, we got the black pearl. Where's my, oh, an old, that's why this is called an old friend. It's because the mermaid lady is the old friend. She can actually kind of weird looking. There's no, no cab, guys. Steve, go home. Welcome. He says, how you doing, guys? Welcome, Steve. It's good to see you, buddy. Can't wait for Just Dance Kids so Kes can do Are You Happy and You... No! No! Uh, fun fact, despite their delicate appearance, pufferfish have bony mouth plates. <laughs> hey, Lily, Brett, before any of you say it, I'm going to go ahead and say it. Your mom has bony mouth plates. Let's go, baby. Let's go. That help them crunch up shellfish, crabs, or any other creatures that end up in their mouths. <laughs> any other creatures that end up in their mouths? No! No, you can't! You just can't! Uh, I can't wait for... Oh, I read that already. This game is weird. It is, isn't it? This track, he says, whoa, it never burps. <laughs> Spore actually starts out like this. She starts as a small little fish. One small organism says it's evolution crap. It needs stuff to become a big organism. Oh, okay, cool. So, okay, that's kind of neat. So, why? Oh, I guess I can see why that would bomb. It probably was a little past its time. But I, that would probably be something I'd enjoy. So far, no sign of the strange creature. Perhaps he's gone even deeper to avoid our pursuit. Things are dark enough here in the place called the Twilight Zone of the Sea. But proceeding further would be in the treacherous Midnight Zone, a depth where no sunlight can penetrate. Tip, sometimes you can use jellyfish to your advantage. If you've got a predator hot on your tail, try to lure him into a jellyfish. Just make sure that you don't get caught up in the stunning sting too. Eat fish, get bigger. All right. I think it's time for me to eat fish and get bigger, guys. Ah, stink. Naughty mind, guess. What are you talking about, Willie? I didn't do nothing. I, I was framed. I was framed, guys. I didn't. I didn't do nothing. I didn't do anything. Anything. <laughs> okay. Black pearl, please. Come on. Be a good little clam and open up. Okay. A white pearl. It's not as good, but at least it's something. Okay. Okay. Oh man. Yeah. Do you know? Do you know what I don't like, guys? Do you know what I don't like? It's like there's actually women out there who like you. You'll they'll want their boyfriend to propose to them, so they'll like make they'll like make these really really super. Uh, what's the word? Like manipulative things, right? They'll do these super manipulative things. Like they'll just leave. You know, passive aggressive was another word I was looking for. Though we like passive aggressive um, pamphlets and stuff, like for for wedding ring shops and you know the stuff where, of course, they're gonna like, sell like the the four thousand dollar Disney cut diamond crud or whatever the hell it is. You know what I, you know what I'm talking about? And it's like it's like it's just the 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 energy behind that is just it's it's bad. It's it's terrible. It's like. Big giant red flag, get away! Remove this person from your life. It's it's true it's a true tragedy. Okay? Alright. Just like your mom. Okay. I'm sorry. Anyway. Then you move on to becoming a land organism where you reach tribal age and civilization. Cool. Okay. Uh not me, I'm so pure wool, says Holy, in refer reference to naughty minds. 
Uh, and the creature creator is just amazing and spore mostly for unintended reasons. Cool. Cat's going to happy dance and just dance kids, but Cat's face is not happy. <laughs> Uh, okay, the juvenile African Pompano has long filaments at the ends of its fins. These get shorter as the fish ages. Woo woo. Prepare yourself for a trip in the deepest, darkest realms of the ocean. No sunlight can reach the waters of the midnight zone. Woo -woo. Here below 3,000 feet, the water is cold and pitch dark. Eddie will have to use her bioluminescent aura to light the way. Even with her handy light, Eddie's visibility is limited here in the deep. Eat the going plankton to help charge her whirr so you can see better in the dark. If you spot a light bulb power, be sure to grab it. It will give you an even bigger light boost. Okay, see so guys, our uh, vision space is very limited, but that'll make it get a little bigger, at least for a while. We have to keep eating them to keep the screen all lit up, basically. The light bulb um, bubbles help too, but see, then the screen will start getting dark again. Then these will kind of like glow. This is actually a mechanic I thought was really cool in this game, was the keep the screen lit up concept. So, you know, again, this game is never something like that you would write home about and say this is the most amazing game ever, 10 out of 10, but it's a fun little casual game. Oh, and now I'm dead. Uh, okay. Oh well. Okay, let's go ahead and go over here. Double frenzy. Nice. How's your GTA petition to bring back the GTA 2 announcer? Double yeah, frenzy. Lily, how's that going? Double we frenzy. gotta keep that going. We gotta keep the thunder alive Double on that frenzy. project. Spore, the only game where you can... Ah, stink, I did it again. I was so close that time. Only game where you can make a... Oh, no. Monster become the apex predator and eventually make it into space. Hmm. Well, I don't know how to feel about that if I'm being completely honest. I mean, hooray, I suppose. Yay. Variety. Oh, man. That's kind of funny. In a roundabout sort of way, I suppose. Okay. Nice. 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 Okay, beating Frenzy just reminded me of Kill Frenzy from GTA. I'll check. Still at four signatures. Mm. Kill Frenzy from GTA? I could see that. In the wild, queen triggerfish are loners. It is difficult to keep more than one triggerfish in the same aquarium because they will fight with one another. Hmm. This detective business is hunger work. Time to take a break and recharge with a brand new bonus stage. A school of unsuspecting minnows has wandered into these dark waters, and they'll make a perfect midnight snack. Try and chop all the fish before the timer runs out. Use the glowing plankton to help you track down minnows in the darkness. There's a limited number of these glowing goodies, so don't be too greedy. If you use them all up at once, it'll be hard to track down your prey. Okay then. So, I'm gonna try to conserve the thingamajigs if we can much as possible within reason you know because we gotta we gotta keep the spirit alive the spirit of christmas over here you know i don't i know any of this has to do with christmas you know eating fish and whatnot but i suppose suppose it's up in there somewhere i hope okay super frenzy hello fishies There's one more somewhere, guys. I have like 30 seconds. Oh, I think the bubble was actually the last thing. Oh, okay. Well, GG, I guess. <laughs> uh, goodness. Guess you have just dance, kids. I I don't not familiar with it at all. Look up Spore Creature Creator on YouTube, Lily. Says Chicken Word. Yeah, Spore sounds weird. It does, but it sounds it sounds like it'd be fun though. After that tasty snack, it's time to get back to business. Even elusive sea creatures have to eat. So let's pay a visit to one of the few feeding spots here in the Midnight Zone. A deep sea vent warms up the water for predators and their prey. Perhaps our quarry made a stop here for some food. Watch yourself and try to keep the lights on. Uh, 
All right, thankfully there's not there's an unlimited amount of those here, so that'll make my life a little easier for a bit. So that's that's nice, you know. It's probably be probably good access to food on this level. Seems like there's plenty of fishies to eat. That's for sure. We can grow up real good here. Mega frenzy. Nice. Again, gotta keep the lights on. Or at least, oh, come on. Lame. Super lame. Thankfully, they give you plenty of lives. So it's not like you're gonna, like, lose and have to start, you know, everything all over again. Unless you just really, really suck at this. Which, like, if you're, like, a, if you're, like, seven or eight years old and playing this, it happens. But I think most of you out there who are like avid gamers, probably, you're probably gonna be okay, you know, on a casual sort of game like this. But hey, shout out to all my feeding frenzy brothers out there. <laughs> oh man. I still love the visuals, but the music took a really dark twist. Huh. Now here we go, super mysterious. This is actually kind of tripping me out a little bit. I can't even lie. I know that's silly, but it is. <sighs> oh, goodness. Where did Brett disappear to? I don't know, dude. He did say that when he was having, like, some, some storm problems, maybe, potentially there. So it might have something to do with that. Humphead Rass. <laughs> what kind of a name is that? Humphead Rass can live to be more than 30 years old. I just want to hear the backstory to how it got his name. Catch that fish. Oh, the mystery continues as Eddie only caught a brief glimpse of that of the peculiar predator. He was heading towards Buccaneer Bay. Buccaneer Bay? Whatever. Where the waters are too shallow for a deep sea dweller like Eddie. It's time to pass the torch on to a new hero, Peter the Pompano. Uh, welcome, Peter. Peter is more familiar with the perilous waters of Buccaneer Bay. A graveyard of pirate ships that some say is still haunted. Uh, look out for some strange new creatures in this region. Rumor has it that some squid-like cuttlefish have taken up residence in these eerie waters. Watch out for strange new critters. Okay. Alright, so basically you don't want to get involved in their little inks thing there. So a lot of little pirate ships here for some reason. It's very, very green, very gross water. A lot of icky, a lot of algae, you know. And these guys you can eat, you just kind of have to sneak up on them a little bit. You know what I'm saying? So it's all about, it's all about that. Super crazy. It's all about, but see, if you get in their little quad, you kind of spin around off in the darkness. You know what I'm saying? And, you know, spin around off in the darkness, that's not fun. Not even a little bit. Oh, oh, see? Yeah, he lose control. Oh, no, you know, so... But hey, then you have a tasty treat. Mega the good news is other fish get all messed up in that same thing, and then they don't really see you or try to eat you. See? See? We got it. Oh, we can we can eat the medium fish now. Oh, and the barracuda. Your mom has a barracuda. Oh, oh. Nice, nice. Come to Papa. Woo! Let's go. Oh, stink. Oh man, uh, this is fun though. There. Woo, get the tail bite, let's go. Let's bloody go. Faux show, no mo. Ah, <laughs> got the cloud. Triple frenzy. Nice. Mermaid girl, woo, let's go. Triple frenzy. Wonder how the game knows what side to put her Super on. Does it frenzy. just know what side of the screen I'm on? Or do I just magically guess the correct side each time? Can I sworn that sure three streams in a row, and true. No, I haven't, had have I? I don't think so. Okay, probably just, probably just one that looks like this. I have multiple shirts that are, you know, look the same. Um. Well, he becomes the wife of announcer dude from GTA 2. Oh my goodness. Okay. Got another Barracuda bonus. Always nice. Fun fact. Pufferfish are greedy. Supposedly a lot of food is... Oh wait, we read that already. 
They're starting to repeat the facts. Super lame. Creepy looking creatures are cuttlefish. They aren't very big, but they sure are skittish. Or should I say, squiddish. Cuttlefish have a squid-like defense mechanism to fend off approaching predators. If a cut mind the ink, if a cuttlefish spots a large fist approaching, it will dash off, leaving behind a trail of blinding ink. If you get caught in the ink cloud, you'll be blinded and disoriented for a few seconds. The effects will wear off, but being blinded in these dangerous waters can be deadly. Try to sneak up on a cuttlefish from behind to avoid their ink. Okay then. Good to know. Okie dokie. Feeding da -da -da. Go ahead and do that. Thank you. Nice. <laughs> Go ahead and grab all those guys. There's the there's the big one right there. Okay, take these guys out. Now we got the medium ones. Mega frenzy. Okay. The bombs are really freaking me out, I can't even lie. Like no cap. No, oh, I almost I almost bit the tail, but no. Oh I almost hit Mega that. That would have been bad. I really shouldn't be this close to the top. Like that's really not good policy. Oh no, crap, and I was almost there. Okay, next time on Catch That Fish with Cass. I know, right, dude? Oh, goodness. It's so true, though. All right, we're on the, with the big ones now. We're all good. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna stay on a Barracuda Man's way. I'm not really concerned about getting that Barracuda bonus this time, you know what I'm saying? I'm more like just get, get to fish eat, you know what I mean? Instead of catch that fish, it's eat that fish. I'm all about that fish eating life. Woo. Which is ironic, because in real life I don't even like fish. Which is a shame. I want to like fish, I just don't. I need a square defense mechanism to fend off approaching predators. <laughs> Guess going to be tired when he do Reputin in Just Dance 2, hardest dance it Russian. Dang. That would be crazy. For the rank of Hungry Hunter, the average great white shark is 10 to 15 feet long, while larger specimens can reach 21 feet in length. Very cool. Mm. Tired of avoiding all those predators to reach your pint-sized prey? Try grabbing a feeding fury, or excuse me, a feeding furry, fury? Yes, power up. Eat one of these and you'll go on your feeding rampage. Zipping around the screen, eating everything in sight, as long as it's smaller than you. Tastes great and saves you time. Take care when you gobble one of these up. After your frenzied feast, you'll end up right where you started. If you end one too close to a predator, your victory lap might be cut short. Take the fury power up for a test drive. Interesting. Well, this will be uh, this will be fun. I do remember this one feeding from feeding frenzy one. This was this was a fun little power up. Okay, went back to the more relaxed environment as well. Uh, I would like... You would like... This game more if the fishes had Mac. And Mac 10s. What's... What, pray tell, is a Max 10? Is that is that a bloody gun? Cause, dude, if that is a bloody gun, I swear to stink. Okay, I will be very, very... Displeased, all right. And not in, not in the happy. Oh, that's so funny way. You know, no, I'm teasing. I'll shut up. Okay. Okay. I don't even know what the stink I'm talking about anymore. Nice. He got eaten. Let's get it. Oh, nice. That was great. Those are good. They keep your bonuses high too, because you like literally are eating everything. It's just about as good as you can, you know. No, oh, I'm so stupid. I am so stupid. Okay, let's try that again. Okay, that got me a good start, but it's not gonna be anywhere near enough. Black Pearl, that's a good progress. Okay. We've totally got this, guys. We have totally got this. I believe. I believe in the Empire. Not really, okay. Get the medium ones now, that'll be good. 
Oh boy, here comes Barracuda, man. You know, Mr. Mega. Tail Chomp himself. In the flesh. Mega frenzy. Okay, grab that, grab that. Big guys now. Until Mr. Barracuda Man comes back. Hey there, Mr. Barracuda Man. How you doing? Nice. G stinking G, baby. Oh, goodness. Mac 10 is an SMG. Oh, really? The guy had an Osama bin Laden look. Who, who did? The earliest pearl farmers were Chinese in the 5th century. Some placed tiny images of Buddha inside mollusks to produce pearled statuettes. That's kind of cool. Almost kind of messed up, too. But cool. On the back side of Pirate Island, there seems to be fewer sunken ships. Human treasure hunters have been through here, and it looks like they left behind some nasty mines to ward off their competition. That's kind of screwed up if you think about it. A school of minnows, like, they could, somebody could, like, have their head blown off. A school of minnows, you know, just head chunks floating through the water. That's disgusting. A head of minnows is lost. A school of minnows is lost in this maze of mines, and that means it's time for some bonus stage action. Stun bubble power-ups give you a break from the constant dance of predator and prey. Grab one to stun all fish around you for a few seconds as an added bonus stun bubbles will explode nearby mines. Sounds good. Let's do it. Okay. I think for a very brief second I didn't have my vacuum ability, which kind of stunk a little bit. I can't even, can't even why like no cap, you know? Okay. Well, let's grab all this real quick if we can. Mega frenzy. Woo! Nice. Nice. Three more. We just need three more. There's one. Oh no! That was so close. We've got. We have time. Just chill. Nice. Let's go. Beautiful. <sighs> okay. Mike, if you're wondering why I keep. Hey, uh, itching my shoulder. It's got a. It that was one of the ones with the bug bites. Okay, trouble in paradise. Looks like all these mines and sunken ships starting to pollute the ecosystem. Some of these poise, poor minnows seem to be affected by an illness. Turns their scales and has to shade of green. Yuck! One thing's for sure, they definitely don't look appetizing. Yes, yeah, so those are the ones that poison you, just like in the first game. Oh, and then you, and then you, um, apparently you spit it out. That's actually. Kind of cool. That's some cool attention to detail. I don't even remember that being in the game. I don't remember that being in here. It wasn't in Feeding Frenzy 1. I don't remember it being in Feeding Frenzy 2, but I guess it is. You actually spit them out in this version. That is really cool. Well, at least we're not around sunken pirate treasure ships anymore. And some of you might be like, Kess, why are you anti-sunken pirate ship people? Oh, he didn't spit out the minnow. That means he ate the minnow, guys. Anyway, let's go down here real quick. Try to wait. Stay. That guy, th th that fish has a face that makes me think his name is Murphy. Okay, he just has a he just has a very relaxed, very Murphy-looking face. Can we just all have a Murphy ate me? All right, screw Murphy. All right, we need to make some we need to make some some anti-Murphy merch. You know what I mean? Me, and we'll take the we'll take the proceeds from the anti Murphy merch sale, and use it to make anti Murphy bombs. It'll be like a Kickstarter. It'll be amazing. Okay, all based on me doing poorly in a feeding frenzy game. Okay, you had you had the poison effect way less than I did, Murphy. Okay, hashtag Nerfy Murphy. That's what we need. We need to Murph the overpowered Nerfy. Nerfy the overpowered Murphy. I can't even talk anymore. I, I, I ruined it guys. I ruined talking for myself I think I'm just gonna start talk stop talk. Oh man. I think I'm gonna stop talking forever. That's it. Your boy is becoming a What's it called? No commentary YouTube channel. All right, let's go. I sh no more commentary forever. All of my content is now Nothing but gameplay and the occasional text screens Eh. Well, Mal, Lily, I got it, said Nico. I'm glad he got it. Kess, do you have any pets? I feel like you got a cat or, or a fish. <laughs> uh, I used to have a kitty, but no, currently don't have any pets. Well, your puns are amazing. Nonverbal YouTuber, there you go. 
You did rooting it. You did rooting it. I don't know what rooting it means, but okay. The very strong teeth of the queen trigger fish often stick out of the fish's mouth and are sometimes called fangs. <laughs> That's funny. Oh, hey, we get to play as Murphy later. That's fine. Follow the trail of green fish and debris. Peter comes across another shipwreck. Humans can't be that clumsy. There has to be something that ties together all this destruction. Could it have something to do with the strange sea creature we've been tailing? Oh my gosh! Okay, it's easy to make mistakes while your fish is poisoned. When you swallow a poison minnow, don't panic. Try to avoid moving around too much and tap the left mouse button to shake off the effects as quickly as possible. Get chomping, son. Woo woo. Eating frenzy. Okay. Get the pearl. Frenzy. Double frenzy. Uh, da -da -da. school Super bonus, frenzy. nice. Mega frenzy. Nice. Oh crap! I tried so hard. What pun? The SMG. It is an SMG. Hit. <laughs> it is. Double frenzy. Oh dang. Okay. Double frenzy. Nice. Double frenzy. Triple frenzy. Okay. Super frenzy. Woo! Oh, please, no, please, no, please go away. Okay. He's gone. Woo! Mega okay, frenzy. no more him. Alright. Okay. Pearl. Mega yes, please. Frenzy. There we go. Now we can eat the medium ones. I almost didn't make it with that pearl. That was kind of risky. Super I bet you if I ate one of those fish when it had the minnow in it, it wouldn't be able to spit it out. But I bet you I still wouldn't get affected. Which I say only because that happened earlier when someone ate me and the same Super thing. I don't even know what I'm saying. Oh, please. No, please, please, please. No! I tried. The fish need a submachine gun. Oh! Oh! Oh, that is brilliant. Good job. Good job. Okay, all right, we're good. He didn't these poison minnows were gonna be the death of me yet like literally He's, They're terrible. That's just is the worst. Oh Hey, I made everything tiny again. Hooray It's just what we need. We need a break like that Triple frenzy. Nice up to the big ones now now as long as there's no sharks, I'm fine. That's good. Let's go around and eat everything. Anyone else? There's another shark. Mega frenzy. Nice. Whew. You're multitasking, so you got an excuse. Hmm. Yellow box fish can be difficult to keep as aquarium pets. If provoked, they release, they release toxins that can kill other fish in the tank. Boy dang. Bonus battle in this corner. Peter the Pompano, our fearless and hungry hero. In the other corner, three angry barracuda, the fish with glass tails. Nimble, nim, nimble, nibble a barracuda tail four times in a row to get him shrink to an edible size. Try to eat three barracuda before the timer runs out. Oh, we actually have to do the Barracuda thing as a bonus level. Three times. Oh, this is this might actually be the bonus stage that I fail. Which, according to the game, there's no... There's no fail in bonus stages, apparently. It's just... It's only good, but no bad. But I consider every failed bonus stage a failure of my life, you know? But no, I think we're doing fine, if I'm being honest. So, see, we got him. Woo, let's do it. I was thinking maybe we wouldn't be able to do it, but no, we're doing fine. I don't know what I was worried about. Yeah, those little minnows, if he does bite me, he'll bite one of those instead. So, okay, that was actually really easy. I was really worried that it would be hard, but that was that was very easy. <sighs> Well, don't say that, Cass. I like hearing you. Oh, thank you, fun time. That's nice of you to say. Okay. Alright, anyway. So, uh, yeah, that was fun. 
Okay, anyway, the flurry of activity around the shipwreck can only mean one thing. Our mystery menace must be near. Ah, oh, he seems to be on a trajectory towards Rass Creek. Maybe we can track him down before he gets there. Shiny distraction. Sometimes all you need to distract a vicious predator is something shiny. That's where the Looney Lure power-up comes in. Chomp one of these and you'll summon a decoy so alluring your predators won't be able to resist following it. With all the big fish lured away, you have a few seconds of stress to be freed. I remember that. That was a, that was a fun... That was a very fun little power up. Back to eating and shipwrecks. Hey, a fish has got to eat, ladies and gentlemen. We're gonna trip to rid the ocean of other fish by eating them. All right, and see that big lure? Okay, that's gonna make everybody all go away so I can eat my food and not have to worry about getting chomped on. At least for a moment. Now everybody's coming back again. See, now they're gonna go away. Yes, right, run, swim, do whatever the hell you gotta do. Just go and eat somewhere else. Pretty pleased with lots of cheese. Okay. Nice. Whew, okay, okay. Mega frenzy. Okay. I don't think I need to stand near him when he's following, but I don't know if he'll eat me or not, but why, why tempt it, right? Why make it any more tempting? Or unnecessarily difficult than you have to. Hopefully I'm making sense. This is the last level we have with whatever this guy's name was. I don't remember because I don't care, but yeah, say say goodbye to this guy. No crap. We were almost done too. I was gonna say say goodbye to this guy, cause we get to we get to play as whatever name I gave that big fish, Murphy. Yeah. We get to play as Murphy the Turfy for a while, so that'll be that'll be fun. If you don't know what I'm talking about, then good, you're still saying it. Okay. Alright. Anyway, co-worker... Wait a minute. Well, station! Ooh-woo! Okay. Well, I, yeah, I guess they are my little pog champ. Co-worker 1, I'm cold. Co-worker 2, go to the corner. It's usually around 90 degrees. That doesn't make any sense. Uh, Steve, yeah, there's a gas leak there, so I guess it would be 90 degrees. No making sense. Mellinger fish attached himself to a female and lives as a parasite for the rest of his life. Really? Oh my gosh! Wow! So, th oh man, wow! Wow, you know, people do that too. So it's just, it's not gender specific with people, it, everyone does. <laughs> mm. Time for another hero to take over as our mystery creature leads us to Rass Reef. The marlin and sharks in these waters can be pretty mean and Harry the Humphead Rass is perfect for the job. So his name's Harry, not Murphy. I like Murphy better, I'm gonna call him Murphy. Harry's a native of these parts, more importantly, he's bigger than our buddy Peter. You know who else is bigger than P mm. Jump for balloons, because they're back, and they have power-ups that are shiny, we guess, because we don't know, and we don't care. Ooh, no! There's not much I could do when they're that close to the, to the bloody, to the bloody stinking top of the, you know, thing. Okay. Gotta eat the stuff. Haven't had enough. Now I'm dead. Go watch someone else instead. No, please don't. I need the views. Okay. Okay. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Okay. Thank goodness this isn't timed mode. We have to do time mode after this, so yeah. We got we got uh, we got stuff to do, so we got we got lots of lots of play. Oh stink, okay, there's that whir that keeps us from getting bit on, so that's nice. Cause we might have uh that happens soon. It happens sometimes. Just, I don't know, jumping for flies or whatever is just so satisfying in this game. Super frenzy. Something about getting a little crowd of flies. Mega frenzy. Just makes you feel like a man. Butterflies in the air and whatnot. Ooh, okay, there's that shark back again. Wonder how we're gonna handle that. How can we do handle that professionally? Hmm. Pass cut corners in buildings are normally 90 degrees. Oh, really? I didn't know that. Oh, that's interesting to know. 
The oldest leopard shark on record was a male that reached 24 years of age. Wow. That's older than me. Oh, man. By the way, can I just say I'm really happy I have such an awesome audience. Like, you guys are really cool, you know? You guys are really great. I'm just glad to have you guys try to hang out with and play games and talk. That's pretty cool. Mm. Plunging peril. A flock of pelicans. As if all these big fish weren't enough to worry about. Now, a flock of pelicans has taken notice of all the activity in the reef, and they've decided to drop in for a bite. Wing terror. Watch where you jump. Pelicans can gobble you up midair if you aren't careful. Some have even been known to swoop down and scoop up fish near the surface of the sea. Keep an eye out for this new feathery menace. Alrighty then. Let's do it. Ooh! But see, with the shrinky mushroom things, we can make him tiny and then we can jump up and eat him. Oh, we can have the terrifying fish eat birds thing happen again. And then you can all remember the Penguins of Madagascar show where they said birds eat fish, not the other way around. So, yeah. Okay. Yes. I, I will come for you, Pelican. I will come for you. Oh. Oh. Okay. Nah. Nah, though, fam. Okay. Grab that. I've been doing pretty good lately. I can't complain. Just wish I had me a little mushroom things off. Getting plenty of little decoy minnows. Mega anyway, frenzy. when I get cold, hold up. Oh, he says, when I get cold, um, I go sit in the corner. Really? I, I never knew any of this stuff. Huh. Well, that's good to know for future Mega reference frenzy. then. When I get cold, I usually just go outside. This is the middle of winter, obviously. <laughs> Uh, actually, I think the heating is still messed up. I still need to call the landlords and ask them to send the guy back over here to fix it. I think he had to, like, order a part and he never got back around to fixing it. So, gotta get on that, because eventually it's gonna get cold again. Oh, no! Oh, I missed one. There you go. There you go. Mm. Very nice. A warm current has washed a smack of jellyfish into the reef. With all the pelicans, sharks, and jellies around, everybody seems to be hanging out in the reef except for our mysterious monster. Maybe we should set course toward the open waters of Sharktooth Ridge. Try this if you're feeling daring. Grab a speed boost before you jump out of the water. You can get huge air and pack in a lot of flips for sweet style points. Style points are great. Watch out for those pelicans. All right, let's do it. Woo, style points, yeah, pelican, not so much, yeah. Oh, okay. Well, that stinks. I like the, f hey, don't those flies just make you happy inside, though? Don't they just make you happy to see a live when you see them? And if you say no, then you're just not a real person. You're a robot. Prepare to die. Okay, okay, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. That, that was a little aggressive. Okay, let's just, let's just everybody calm down and enjoy the pretty visuals while we slaughter all these innocent fish and they go home to their or, and they no longer can go home to their now orphan children fish yes I just took this serenic experience and made it terrible and that's why we're going to become a no commentary channel so I can quit ruining games once and for all uh, and with that Test Gaming's identity as a channel walked off into the sunset never return. And then we can then we can play some song like uh, You Only Get What You Give by whatever the hell that band's name is. No, I didn't say I do that, I'm just saying I will. Oh, okay. Cass, I didn't know either. I thought it was a ghastly joke about getting set on fire. Oh really? That's funny. I'm scratching my ankle, guys. Really bad bug bite. To allow to expand, the stomach of a puffer fish is pleated like a Scottish kilt. Okay. Well, if I ever, if I'm ever swimming out in the ocean and I see a, one of those puffer fish going by, I'll be like, you are wearing a Scottish kilt. And then he'll be like, ah. And then I'll, I'll walk away. So, 
Uh, on our way out to deeper waters, we find this tempting mass of munchies. There's a huge school of quick moving minnows and swarm of mayflies here for your bonus chomping pleasure. Only catch is you're not alone. Try to drop the minnows and mayflies before the time runs out. Watch out because a pack of leopard sharks have been tracked from this school and they look hungry. Mmm. 100 minnows and 25 mayflies. Ha ha! This is gonna be tricky. Eating for double frenzy. Triple frenzy, frenzy, mega frenzy. Goodness, that is. There's so many of them. Mega frenzy. No, there has to be a couple more. Minnows, obviously, but like, oh, please, no. Oh, I forgot. I had the little decoy thing. Double frenzy. Crap, I think he got me. Maybe not. Eating frenzy. I'm just saying, I hope I get all of these. <laughs> These bonus levels are tricky sometimes. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. This is so hard to aim. Why is this so hard to aim? It's hard to aim the jumping on this. It's like no mouse control whatsoever. Oh, there's the last bug. There's the last one. I thought the I thought the last one was a minnow, but it wasn't. Okay, we did it. We did it. I don't know how, but we did. G stick a G. Let's go. Okay. Test review of the film Empire by Andy Warhol. When? Why would I review that? I'm on the icon of sin, so I've almost beaten Doom 2. That's awesome, dude. Congrats. We've only beaten a bit, bit once all summer. Really? Um, nice, good job. What do you think of the game? Usually the mosquitoes take a page out of John Romero's book and make me their B-word. Yeah, I know, right? Really like it. A lot of the stages people say are bad. I really like. Uh-oh. Which one? Which one did you like, Chick Lord? Please don't say it. Please don't say it. They make milk innocent, but don't be fooled by these cute little puffer fish. These little guys will inflate like balloons to protect themselves from predators of all sizes. They're quite a defense mechanism. I'm trying to eat the inflated ones. Yeah, no duh. Whoop, Ah, oh, okay, that wasn't inflated when I tried eating it, okay? You weren't right. I didn't learn a lesson. Shut up. Ugh. Idiot. Ugh. Okay. Go ahead and grab all that. Thank you. Get rid of the big guys for a while. Go ahead and eat this little guy. Can't stay small forever, that's what she said. Okay. Gotta w stay away. No, I was about to say we had to stay away from the big tuna. And then the big tuna was not good to me. He was very not good. Okay. Okay. <laughs> uh, okay, I'm sorry, guys. I'm sorry. Okay. Okay. Yeah, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Woo! Woo! Let's go, let's go. Okay, there you go. There you go, big tuna, go bye-bye. Alright, go ahead and grab all this stuff. Oh, grab here, ooh, ooh. Okay, no, pl oh, come on. Hey, at least we moved up a thing, right? At least we moved up a thing. Okay. Eating frenzy. Double frenzy. Hold up. Hold up. Frenzy. Hold up, nice. There we go, they're not even paying attention to me now. I guess I can get anything Super now, I don't frenzy. have to deal with the small little stuff if I don't want to. Oh no, there he is. 
It's amazing what opportunities the puffer fish open up. Or keep them open up. It works both ways. Okay. Anyway, so you've beaten Doom 1 and practically beaten Doom 2. You're like halfway through thy flesh consumed. That's awesome, dude. You're making great progress then. Anyway. Um, I don't hate the chasm. Okay, Stonecast is something else entirely. <laughs> uh, that was level one, though, you were going to say. Yeah. I thought he was going to say, here's what I thought, guys. I, I thought Chicken Ward, I'm going to click out of the game for a second because chat's messed up. I thought Chicken Ward, when he was talking about, uh, when he was talking about which one didn't like, you were said chasm. I thought you were going to talk about the city. That's what I was expecting, dude. Queen Triggerfish, very poor swimmers, propelled themselves maybe by rippling their dorsal fins, then used their tail fins for emergencies. Fascinating. Puffers don't seem to have deterred other predators in the region. Seem to be suffering from a problem here. Too many predators and not enough food. Yeah, it is really hard to find smaller fish at this point to eat. Just saying. Okay. Nice. Super frenzy. Nice. Nice. Mega frenzy. Mega frenzy. Oh, stink. Okay, got that guy taken care of. Nice. Nice. Mega frenzy. Ooh. Oh, well, I tried. I was so close. Yet so far. Eating frenzy. Oh, I thought he was distracted by the whir. Oh, that's not fair. Eating that's frenzy. not fair. Come Eating on, frenzy. fam. You gotta be true. Deep down in, you gotta be one after the word and ignoring, ignoring me. Don't give the heart what it wants, it's dangerous. I right, know, I'm gonna shut up. Alright. Get these guys out nice. Now I can eat the tuna. They thought me and the boys at 2 a.m. looking for tuna. There you go. Here's Barracuda Man. Who doesn't love Barracuda Man? Mega Frenzy. Nice. Okay. I liked all the city levels, industrial zone, and all that. Not the one with the hidden stairs and doors and stuff. You're not allowed to like that. Everybody universally hates that. So, yeah. Bad. Uh, now those pesky puffer fish have invaded our, our friendly bonus stage. Harry's got plenty of herring to chase down here. We have these puffers are going to have to go, too. Try to clear all the fish from the stage for time to run jail. Well, that's what we do with fam. Or at least we're going to try. 75. That's a lot of... That's a lot of that, so... You know. Double frenzy. The vacuum Super is very re resourceful here, I'm just saying. Mega frenzy. Mega frenzy. I'm hoping I can get this. I don't have a lot of time left, actually. Mega frenzy. There's a little time, extra time thing, so. Oh, we only have two more left. I think we're pretty solid right now, actually. All right, GG. Uh, Vincent Toscano, walk me, says, ah, memories, let's go. Yeah, we're doing some Feeding Frenzy too, dude, doing both regular story mode and time attack. So that's gonna be fun, doing a whole series on it. So good stuff, glad you could make it in the stream tonight. And for that tasty bonus, we reached the caves on the border of Sharktooth Ridge. Dangerous leopard sharks sometimes patrol this area in search of easy prey. If our shader quarry has made it this far, then it's daring indeed. The open waters of Sharktooth Ridge are too treacherous for even the heroic Harry to brave. Mm. Keep an eye out for patrolling sharks. You got it, boss. Feeding frenzy. Double frenzy. Triple 
take it out, friends. Nice. Nice. Now we can eat those. We got that. Ooh, steak. Oh, uh, well, I tried. Oh, no, there he is. There he is. Nope. Nice. Grab that. We're gonna vacuum everybody up. I, I know I can eat the medium ones, but you know, there was just so few of them and so few little ones. It was just kind of focusing on that. Just trying to get to where we could get the big guys. Now everybody's just kind of transferring the smoke between one another at this point, I feel like. I wonder if a barracuda can eat a leopard shark or vice versa. Or if they just ignore one another entirely. I wonder if the verdict is still out on that. Oh, hey. Where's Mermaid Girl? No, Mermaid Girl. I didn't Super mean to miss your star bubbles. Mega I love your star crazy. bubbles, Mermaid Girl. That sounds so wrong. Okay. Hold up. Nice. Tailing this guy even more so. Is it odd that I can sleep on the couch with jeans on? Uh, it is, but I do it too, so. Like, I have a bed that I could sleep in, but I must always go for the couch. Oh. Odd, but you're not the only one to do it, so. Meh. Humphead rats can be caught quite easily at night, especially by divers who enter the caves in which the fish sleep. Time to pot the big fish. Meet Goliath. Oh, fun. The great white shark. He's not the biggest shark in the ridge, but with your help, he will be. If anyone can catch up to that beast we shot in these open wars, it's him. Human hideout. Shark Tooth Ridge is home to some sort of undersea human lab. None of the sea life bothers much with what's going on at the lab. The ocean is big enough for both man and fish kind. Take out Goliath for a test drive. Fun, we get to play the big old meaty shark now. Oh man, look at my look at my munching animation. Like how I just my swallowing sensation. Oh, that's so satisfying for no particular reason. And these fish look like tiny little potato chips now. Like yum yum, give me some tiny potato chip fish. Oh. Well that's sad. That's I don't have my tiny Eating puffer tomato fish friends. I don't even know what the hell I'm talking about. Anyway, um Double let's go over here now. Go down this way. Take all these guys down. Ooh, yes. Potato chip. Ho oh, ho! That's what they look like, potato chips. If you had to pick one game to play forever, which one would you pick? I don't know. It would have to be Double something frenzy. I could see myself reasonably Triple frenzy. spending a lot of time on it, ever even getting Super close frenzy. to completing it. It's something I haven't played much of so far. And there's, there's so many different parameters I would have to ask. But, um... Mega yeah, I don't know. That's a really good question, dude. I think I had an answer on one stream, but since then I've long since forgotten what it was. But, yeah. Mega so, it would be very, very hard to say. It would definitely have to be a game with a ton of replay value, you know what I'm saying? Tons of achievements, ton of stuff to do and to work Mega on. Frenzy. Maybe even a live service model game that was constantly getting new content added to it. It's a loaded question. Can it be multiplayer? Yeah, he didn't he didn't specify, so you know, I'd say kinda all bets are on the table. What happened to Sea Lab? Something has come through and wrecked havoc on the lab. Could be a way to all these shipwrecks. What does this strange shadowy creature have to do with any of this? Keep chomping, we'll get to the bottom of this. So the lab's all screwed up, I take it. Oh, here's our puffer fish friends again. Hooray. Oh, that, you know, whale killer thing ate the puffer fish, so. Not good, I guess. No, he ate the puffer fish, he ate the other shark. He ate the leopard shark. Oh man, I kind of want pizza right now. Like, no cap. Too bad I don't have pizza. I sure wish I had pizza. Oh, no. If I actually wanted pizza, I guess I could have some tomorrow. And I probably am not gonna want pizza tomorrow. I will probably want something entirely different. And I will probably eat something entirely different. By the way, guys, uh, just to let you know, on Monday we're going to be 
doing our last Wolfenstein Blade of Agony stream, where we'll be finishing the game's campaign on doing the last two missions. Um, we will also be doing some maximum, oh crap. We're doing some more maximum doom. We'll be starting on the end levels. So yeah, exciting stuff coming on Monday for the doom series. Oh man, man, I am stupid. I am really stupid. I am a stupid little stink face. Okay, are we good? I need to get away from those things. I can't keep my mouth to myself. That doesn't make any sense at all. Okay, yeah, let's go. Let's go where those guys aren't gonna be getting close and chomping my face off would be would be quite lovely, you know. Alright, we're almost there. We're almost to where we can go up against the big guys. There you go. Your boy Goliath in here. Eating sharks. Super frenzy. Hello. Ooh, super frenzy. Like super stunned. Mega frenzy. Like super stunning. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yum out. Oh, you know. All right, we're good. We're good. Okay. Anybody else? Ooh, -hoo. ooh, big old boy. Okay. Look at that little angel snow f Mega flake frenzy. potato chip. Cause I'm the Shark Goliath, I guess. Guy with no name says, Catch you look tired. I am tired, my friend. Very, very tired. I need some sleep. My brain instantly went to Sonic 3 and Knuckles, so I guess I'm going with that. Um, yeah, like, I'm so tired, I can't even see text without it being boring at this point. I started daydreaming, and all I could hear was you about pizza. <laughs> I think he's been getting very good sleep recently. I, I haven't, actually, no. It's kind of a shame. Um, my would be GTA 5, mostly because it's GTA 5 Story and GTA Online. You know, that would be. Here's the thing, dude. If I'm thinking of what a game would be, that would definitely be one of a contender for it. That's for sure. So, he's been smoking the funny grass. <laughs> uh, it's it's wax. It's funny wax. It's not grass, but sure. Okay, let's continue. Tuna treats. The quick moving schools of tuna here and shark tooth ridge make for tasty shark treats. But watch out for schools of toxic minnows. With all the killer whales around, one bad bike get you in a lot of trouble. Watch where you point that thing. Be careful with that inhale ability. It works on all fish, even the poison ones. If you eat one of those toxic critters, remember to tap the left mouse button to quickly shave, shake off its effects. Gobble tune as fast as possible. Okay. Let's go ahead and... Oh, no. No. Oh, they're in schools now. That's, that's, that's bad. That's going to be a, a ginormous issue I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to wager. Oh, that was that was lovely. That was lovely, guys. Oh, please no, please, please. What could I do if I moved? It was just going to take you less time. This is going to be a very difficult level. I'm already, I'm already thinking it. Oh, please stop that! <laughs> ah. Okay, guys, I've got to focus, guys. I've got to focus because I'm, I'm dying out here. Oh my gosh, what is wrong with me? For real, what the hell is going on? Okay, hold up. Hold up. Okay, see? Those little fish are yummy, dude. You can't eat those, you stay away from the others. It's not that hard. All right, at least it shouldn't be. Fine, I'll stay here at the bottom. I'll just chill down here. This looks like a chill place. This is not a chill place anymore. Yeah, there is there is just not enough small fish to go around is the problem. That's what it is. Everybody's everybody's real greedy. Your mom is greedy. <laughs> Sorry. Okay. Nice. There we go, I grew a size. Okay, now I can get the medium guys. And I was getting worried there about like lives, you know? Because I kept getting chomped so many dang times. Just exactly like that. Okay, so we gotta we gotta stay away from Killer Whale over here. Especially since we only got five lives left. Woo, gonna play Fortress Forever match. Well have fun with that, Chick Award. So it was good to, it was good having you here on the stream, buddy. So I look forward to uh, to seeing you again on Monday. We'll be doing the Doom Death Match. So don't forget to check that out. It'll be great. All right. Anyway, 
Oh, I thought I saw the thing. Never mind. Whew. Guy with no name says GG. Thank you, guy with no name. I was just trying to stay alive. It's quite. Okay, we are so close to third. Nice, nice. There we go. All right. Oh, man. Oh, this is so cathartic. We can now eat the big ones that tortured us for forever. Die. He deserves it, guys. Don't pity him. Don't pity this the shameful whale. He's 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 betrayed us forever. All right, I love how we eat all of those and then we just spit out one every time. It's actually a very useful way to get rid of so many of them. It's just a, it's just a long, painful conversion process is all. Well, I actually spat out two that time. I don't know. Maybe that doesn't work that way. 6 a.m. hype. I'm not tired at all. Really, Lily? Yeah, I keep really weird hours these days. So, but thankfully, you guys all live in different time zones to keep weird hours too. So, that works out for everybody. Bonus time. Sometimes just finding food out here in the ocean. That's why, that's why you guys are the best. You're so nice and understanding. Anyway, just finding food out here in the open ocean can be challenging enough. The tune out here are completely unprotected. <laughs> but you'll have to be quick to hunt them all down before the timer runs out. Hint, keep moving and make good use of the rare stun bubbles to give you an edge. Sounds good to me. Also, guys, unfortunately, I'm pouring my last glass of tea. Mm. So we have to drink after this is Pepsi. Big sad, I know. All right, let's continue. Guess, have you thought of listening to raindrops keep falling on my head and read the lighthouse? Actually, yeah, dude, I have... Uh, I do use that sometimes. I'll go on YouTube and get some... Oh, this is a timed one. I didn't realize that. That's right. The music's a little less hype than usual. Anyway, yeah, dude, I'll go on YouTube with some of the raindrops following thunderstorms. I'll play that. Fall asleep. I don't know. I just get, I just get kind of wired. And it just takes me a while to calm down. So... So yeah, but it's okay. We'll I'll get it all figured out. It just takes time. I used to have my sleep all fixed, but then it got all messed up again. But like I said, we'll get it all taken care of. It'll just take a little time is all. All right, we're doing good, guys. We have a minute and eight seconds left to go. We've already gotten like 90 of them, so it's pretty good, I'd say. How much more tuna could there possibly be? We're just like destroying a whole school of tuna. That's actually kind of funny. If you think about it, that's a, that's like a whole school, right? 150? I would assume. I don't know how big a school of tuna is. Like what the average school of tuna size is. Does anybody know what that is? Would someone in the chat be a deer and look that up? How big the average size of school of a tuna is? If nobody does, then I'll, I'll look it up because I actually want to know. Okay, I was wrong, by the way. You spit out exactly the same amount of poison minnows you take in, so the whole filtering idea was unfortunately not very true to life, so big sad, I know. All right, we got 20 seconds to get one more. There you go. G stinking G, baby. I like thunderstorms, too, and rain and waves. Yeah, that's nice. That is very nice. Your sleep schedule's bad. Me, too. Me, too. But oh, well. So, hey guys, since it's kind of late, um, like the stream's been a lot of fun, I've been enjoying it and everything, but since it's kind of late and we are all kind of tired, I am only, I think we're just going to limit this stream just to the story mode of Feeding Frenzy 2, and then next Saturday we can do the time attack game mode. So, that's what we'll do. Submarine snacking. It seems like everybody's hungry today. Killer whales, barracudas, John Dorries, cuttlefish, and you all trying to make a living. Swim carefully or you'll end up at somebody's dinner. Excuse me. So shiny. Keep an eye out for the loony lores. With so many predators around, a quick whir can clear some room to move. Chill down and cuttlefish to get bigger. Okay. Let's go ahead and grab that. Eating frenzy. Grab that. Double frenzy. Grab that. Frenzy. Nice. Ok. 
Okay. Triple frenzy. Oh. Lame. Well, I tried. I tried, guys. Eating frenzy. Woo! Double frenzy. Triple nice. frenzy. Nice. Okay, Super almost frenzy. to big whale time. Big whale time, people. There Mega you go. Frenzy. Mega frenzy, indeed. Your mom's having a mega frenzy. Oh, oh. Okay, I don't like being cloudy the cloudy man right mega now. Frenzy. And no, I don't want to see any concept art of cloudy the cloud man because I could see rule 34 quickly going on that. First results was average size of male organ. Oh no. Okay, sure, I get it. Wait, what have you been searching up? <laughs> oh goodness, actually I don't want to know. Oh, snowstorms, I'll try that. There you go, that actually sounds nice. I might try that too, that's a good suggestion. Leopard sharks are not a danger to humans. There is only a single report of a leopard shark incident in the international shark attack file. No bite was involved. Oh, that's good to know. That's actually really good to know. Trouble from above. Did the humans suspect what's going on underneath the surface? They certainly seem to be dropping a lot more mines than usual. As I wonder if that's current information, because this is from 2006. I wonder if we've had any leopard shark attacks since then. I really want to look that up. Hold up. Leopard sh shark attack. Attack humans. Let's look it up. No reported fatal attacks on humans by leopard sharks. Really? Even to this day? There isn't. I, well guys can't really see, but like, look, see? No report of fatal attacks humans by leopard sharks. Isn't that, isn't that interesting? It just, just imagine that, right? Okay. Anyway. Uh, particularly in larger schools, individual position, fish positions were observed to be dynamic, yet the overall shape of the school remained relatively constant. Mean size of schools observed were 18.88 individuals. Interesting. I don't know what the means, but that's the answer. Okay. Well, thanks thanks for sharing, Willie. I don't get it either. I'm not a fish expert. Oh, man. Everybody's, like, super uptight in this level. I think the mines is setting everybody in edge. Like, look at the swimming patterns. That's how you know. That's how you just know, guys. Okay, you're gonna get blown up, little dude, if you don't... If you don't be careful. You gotta just chill, dude. You gotta just chill out. All right, there you go. Well, you you didn't chill. You suffered the cause. That happens. It happens, guys. Nice. Nice. There we go. Woo! Here we go. I'm gonna take him out. Nice. Just grabbed him real quick before he went in there. Okay, wow, it even works on the smaller ones. That's kind of surprising. Oh, if I hadn't grabbed that, that quam totally would have gotten me there. So, uh, mine right there. Actually, has me really worried. Oh, I can get rid of, I can get these guys now. That's pretty sweet. Pay attention to our environment. Mega frenzy. Be as careful as possible. Okay, he took that mine out for me, which I'm glad to say. Whew. This level actually really stressed me out, guys. Just did. And there's Mermaid Girl with her Super little star frenzy. bubbles. Mermaid Mega Girl, you'll frenzy. know my uh, you'll always be my little pog champ, said Goliath the shark. Uh, okay. Alright, we're good guys. Whew, okay. Tricky treats. The humans have stopped dropping their minds, but that doesn't mean it's easy eating. You'll have to nip with care in order to avoid the surging populations of jellyfish and poison fish that have made this part of the ocean their home. Luckily, there are plenty of power-ups to help you out. A lot of puffer fish around these waters as well sneak up on them from behind to catch them unpuffed. I always want mine unpuffed. That's for darn sure. I like to puff them up myself instead of having them pre-puffed. Yeah. That's for... That's for sure. <sighs> nice. 
face. Double Nice. Okay, grab all that. Super frenzy. Grab all that. Uh oh. Had I was like, why is my hand itching? I had an ant crawling on me. <laughs> That's kind of funny, actually. Okay. Ooh. Oh, we're good. All right. Nice. And spit Super that frenzy. little guy out. Grab all these. If we can. Mega oh boy. Mega frenzy. Mega frenzy. Spit all that out, nice. Mega frenzy. And grab all that. Spit them out over there. And grab this as well. Okay. Oh, I just keep, I just keep chomping them, guys. There's the jellyfish. Grab him, grab him. Super frenzy. Nice. Mega frenzy. More of the Rex scientist lab, if I do say so myself. Maximum H2 says, his cats to sharks don't attack humans on purpose. They just get confused because of the color blue and white colors because they think it's a small group of fish. That makes sense. I've also heard they mistake humans for seals sometimes just because the way they swim. Which I, I don't know how much truth there is to that, but I would totally believe Triple it. That frenzy. sounds, you know, just like plausible. Super frenzy. All right, well, GG, guys. Not too shabby. Unearthly visitor, the sea grows ominously silent. The waters are warm and inviting, yet there are no fish around. Could this be the lair of the mystery fish that's been causing so much trouble? Uh oh, there's no way to attack this thing directly. Try buying the intruder's tail to get its attention. It's a risky proposition, but maybe you can worm into a nearby mine and find some sort of weakness. Prevail against the alien intruder. This is a boss fight, guys. This part is a bloody boss fight. I'm telling you. It just is, okay? That's what this is. You have to, you have to bite his tail, worm into a mine, and then you... Eat the mushrooms, which makes him get tiny. That's 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 the name of the game in this, guys. That's the name of the game. It's the name of the boss fight. Ha -ha. And then we eat the star. We eat the star in the car, guys. Oh, and then we get chomped on. Nobody likes to be chompy, the chompo. But see, the mine thing only works if he's not crap. I think it only works if you didn't already previously destroy its face. Any other mines? I was doing good there for a minute, and then I... Doing everything correctly as if I knew what I was doing, and then... And then it all just started failing. Forever. I think we can actually get him this time, believe it or not. But there's another mine somewhere. I chose poorly, now I'm teasing. Here we go, let's go. Let's bloody go. Boom, son. Boom, yummy! Let's go! I think I chased him away. Alright. Good stuff. Should never wear white color clothes. Okay. I want a cute nightlight. The dark is spooky. Yeah, I could see that being pleasant, Willie. Great white sharks have a keen sense of smoke and detect prey from long distances away. I don't like it being super dark, either. You know. Mostly dark, but a little bit of light. Going after the Great White took the only intruder down a peg. Now it's Harry the Humphead's turn. Chased him into shallower waters. But there are fat lionfish and John Dory's crowding these waters. And they're too hungry to care about your mission. Avoid them at all costs. There's plenty of power-ups, which is nice. So that should help us out. Yeah, this is a really crowded area. Look how many... Oh my goodness. Look at the density, though, for real. There's so many fish. I think everybody's just all crowded up in here just because the intruder's driving everybody crazy. I think that's basically the backstory to the game at this at this point in time. That was kind of a risky move. Risk it for the biscuit, I suppose. Oh, stink crap. I was doing so good. I was risking it for the biscuit and no, it just it just did not work. Oh, mushroom man, let's go. They wrote a little song about me once called Mushroom Man. 
It was it was very strange. It was not pog. Oh crap. Crap. Of the non pogness. Triple frenzy. For some reason, oh there it is. I guess it just Mega takes a moment frenzy. to charge. Oh yeah, ability. There's a charging me here, isn't there? I always forget about that. But yes, there is. I'm almost there. I just need more, more fishes. There you go. Got a pearl. I knew I could get bigger. That's what he said. <sighs> I need to grow up a little bit. Oh no. Imagine if Kes fell asleep on stream, a sweep stream. Yeah, you guys have to like donate money to try to wake me up because I still have the headphones on. You're trying to like play the donation notification sound. That would be hilarious stuff that actually happened, wouldn't it? Triple frenzy. Super frenzy. Nice, nice. Too bad I don't work on Bigfoot here, I'll say that. Nice. Alright. Well, we have now got total control of the area. Bloody go. Nice. Nice. Mega frenzy. Beautiful. Sweep stream. Mm. Mm. Maximum H2O says, but don't you like to turn off all the lights and sit in the corner? If you don't, I guess I'm weird. <laughs> uh, yeah, that doesn't sound very pleasant to me, personally. Turn off all the lights and sit in the corner. No, that sounds kind of lonely. Munchy molecules, or mollusks, excuse me. Cuttlefish are thick in the water around these parts, drawing predators from miles away. Or, excuse me, drawing predators from miles around. Expect to see plenty of ink days swimmers competing for these tasty morsels. You have to be smarter than the average fish. Snap up your share of these tiny treats. Okay, so just try to grab them, because that's the only thing we can eat right now. If we're expecting them to grow at all. So, we got to do that, unless we want to just subsist entirely off of Barracuda Tail. Which just like long- and pearls, which I just don't think would be very sustainable long term. You know what I'm saying? Oh, come on! I really needed that black pearl. I knew it was risky, but I had to- I had to at least try. Surely you understand. Oh, so you can- you can go buy them when they're on the lure. They won't still try and come after you or anything. That's good to know. That's very nice to know. Go ahead and grab that. Okay, go ahead and grab that. Thank you. Who else? Nice, the clam got him. I wonder if that's why clams do that way, but no, that's not how that works. Okay, oh no! I forgot the smoke. They can still eat you. Okay, let's try this nonsense one more time. Use the whir. Sleep with uh, your desk light on? Okay. Interesting. I think that fish ate a black pearl. If he ate a black pearl and took it away from me, I'm gonna be really upset. I'm gonna also be really upset if I keep dying all the time. Dang, I need to play this a little bit better. I want those clouds screw me up too much the problem. It's too hard to control yourself when you've been all inked around. There's so many big guys too, you know. Okay. Nice. Alright, we're doing okay. There's the whir. So that's good. Nice. Nice. Give it a sec. I just want to get up to medium fish. Okay, I thought those guys were seriously going to get me, but I guess they didn't. So that's nice. Oh no. Oh no, 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 no. Wow, okay. All right, GG guys, we did it. We made it to medium fish. Woo woo. I feel complete now. 
Not really. I'm gonna complete once we finish, maybe. At least until next Saturday. Uh. Let's go. Let's bloody go, son. I'm surprised they don't give you more of a more of like food bonus for that because that's that's very challenging to actually get one of those guys like that, you know? It's no small feat to get his tail four times, I dare say. Oh, I missed it. Oh well. <laughs> Hold up, we're almost to the big ones now. Nice. Nice. Okay. You forgot to smoke. That's rare for you, Kess. Forgot to smoke? What are you talking about? What do you mean, forgot to smoke? What does that mean? Okay. Oh. Alright, let us continue. Darkest danger. Other fish in deep sea life have fled this area, sensing danger. That can only mean one thing, the mysterious intruder is near. The intruder from the stars has learned from its battle with Goliath the Great White Shark. It's picked up a couple of new tricks that will make it even more difficult to defeat. Swim carefully. Drive the intruder into shallow waters. Alright, same basic gameplay, except this one actually has a... Is like a... Like tries to suck you in with the vacuum. For the mines, but it's the same basic boss fight otherwise. You might actually suck in the mine if you were to. Oh no! I'm an idiot. I'm a dumb, dumb face. Yeah, yeah. You know, sometimes, guys, sometimes I type. I just hate my own face. Just a little bit. Oh my gosh! I only have two lives left. What's wrong with me? Oh my gosh, dude. Like, just no, give me a bloody break. Okay. All right, we're good. We're good. It's all gonna be okay. You just need to chill, you cast. It's all right. It's just a game. It's okay. Just calm down, all right? Don't, don't, don't let yourself see they gave you a third wife because they like you, okay? Okay, cast. It's, it's gonna be okay, little buddy. It's gonna be okay. All right, anyway. Anyway, see, he, 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 he turned now. He turned. I like killed Bob. Okay. Uh, really, have I ever say that your profile picture gives me Rainbow Six Siege vibes? <laughs> this means a Call of Duty character. That's kind of similar to Rainbow Six Siege, right? I'm sure people are going to be triggered at me now. Watch to eat. The intruder fled from Harry the Humphead's persistent attacks. Now it's up to Peter the Pump Pound to pursue the unearthly foe ever closer to land. Tasty herring are plentiful in these waters, but so are hungry marlins and leopard sharks, as well as those pesky poison fish. And there's bugs and pelicans, too. According to the wisdom that is the main menu screen. Or not main menu screen, pre-level screen? Yeah, let's go with that. Pre-stage screen, I don't know. Whatever the hell it's called, I guess. Woo, yay, oh, I did it again, didn't I? Yep. Yep, I did. Please don't die. Again, cause like I've been, I've been doing so good. It would just be a shame to like screw it all up by like losing my last wives. Come on! I don't want to. I don't want to ah, restart my score. Ah, ah. Sorry. Please no. Please give me a break. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. There we go. See, I got the thing now. I got the thing, guys. No one's gonna get me now. Ooh. Be as aggressive as I want to now that I have the rainbow thingy. Because who wouldn't want the rainbow fishy? I got two rainbow fishies. Okay, I need one there you go. Now I get the medium guys. Oh, he got he got the medium fishy. Or the rainbow fishy, whatever. Whatever you, know, you want to call it, he got it. Oh. 
Oh, I have continues. Yay. Okay. Okay. Uh, all right. Planning to get another profile pic in the same style, but you with different clothes. Good. Good. Good for you. All right. I love Tire Cats. He's funny. Thanks. Thanks, dude. I think. Uh, I don't like to be super tired. I don't like to be quote unquote unpresentable at all when I stream. You know what I mean? I like to be nice and focused. So, I, I feel like that's the most fun for everybody. But, you know, it doesn't always have to be that way. Especially Saturday streams. They can be a little more laid back. Alright, well, that was nice. That was nice that we have continues in the game. That makes me feel better. Would have hated to have lost my score. Everything. They gave me three more lives, so. Okay, that's okay. I'm, I'm good. I got this. I'm not a total failure. Okay, those poison fish are really Super screwing crazy. me up, dude. All right, we're good. We made it, guys. His eyes are basically closed. Are they really? Maybe that's why I can't barely see anything. Oh, well, let's, let's, let's at least finish the game. What a nice day. Leopard sharks, marlins, pompanos. There sure are a lot of fish out enjoying the warm shallows today. Happily, the poison minnows have moved on, but a party of puffer fish has taken their place. Tip, you can use your inhale ability while jumping. Scarf up swarms of butterflies for a special swarm bonus. Gobble up pufferfish, butterflies, and herring. Sounds good. Okay. Eating frenzy. Nice. Double frenzy. Triple frenzy. Nice. Super frenzy. Mega frenzy. Nice. Mega frenzy. Wow, that's a lot of stuff. Okay, we are at medium now. Medium size is what I would say. <laughs> okay. Oh no, it's it's Big Bird again. Oh no! Come on, man! Why you gotta do me like that? I was, I was almost there. I was almost, to, I was almost the level where I could be eating you. Guess that's why he did it. Rival of the fittest in this game. That's for dang sure. Double frenzy. Triple frenzy. Okay, we good. Yeah, we're good. Okay. Super frenzy. Nice. There's the big boys. Mega frenzy. Nice. Ooh. Ooh. All right. Good stuff. Anyone else missing Portal? You miss Portal, Steve? We'll do some Portal content again. Some point. We still need to do the uh, the actual Flash game, the Portal Flash game. That's like the actual Flash version. I'm missing your mom. Oh, wow. I don't know. I've never seen it. You've never watched my portal stuff, dude? Uh, boxfish don't have overlapping skits like other fish, but instead of rigid box like body made of fused bony plates. Wow. Protector of the seas. Where have all the fish gone? Is it a sign of another intruder attack? Luckily, Peter the Pompano is full and rested. Ready to face the challenge. Ew, ew. Okay. A special treat. The minds of the humans have been useful in the struggle against the intruder, but there are fewer now. And pelicans patrol the surface. With all the shrink shrooms about, though, Peter might just get a chance at a once-in-a-lifetime pelican dinner. Challenge the intruder to a si to single combat. Let's bloody go. Let's bloody go. And see these mushrooms, guys? They can get the bird, too. At least in theory, which is kind of what we're going for. See, there's the bird. No, I want to eat the bird. I wanted to eat the bird, guys. I wanted to eat him so bad. Did you see him get tiny, though? I'm going to make him tiny so we can eat him. Okay, hold up. All right, ready? Set. There we go. 
And now he runs away again. <sighs> okay, we're good. Boss defeated. I'm the earn the rank of greedy gobbler. Woo woo. Okay. Dancing in the dark. Peter's triumph over the intruder saved the day, but what about the night? With the moonrise, the chase becomes more dangerous. It falls to Eddie the anglerfish to seek out the unnatural being in the darkening waters. Midnight snacks, inhale abilities, war bomb. You know, all that good stuff that we do go on and on about. Naturally. Frenzy. Double frenzy. Mega frenzy. Your mama's frenzy. Your mom has frenzies. I would hope, unless she's very lonely. Oh no! Why would you do that, Mr. Quam? Uh... Oh crap, why would I do that to myself? Did you see what I did there, guys? Got way too close to that big fish that inhaled it towards me. I'm really dumb. I'm just kind of a dummy dum dum face. It kind of stinks. It stinks to be the dummy dum dum face in the group. Oh well. I have always sort of been a little bit on the awkward side. Just a wee little bit, you know. Just a tad. Nice. Alright, we got him. We're getting uh, there we go. I was about to say we're getting close to getting the big guys. So that's fun. Um da, da, da. have this, have this. Nice. GG guys. Okay. Just one more before bedtime. <laughs> Midnight snacking, just still a bit peckish. Angler fish need a lot to keep going and they can feed all night long. The box fish have caught on to your munching habits. However, so they're a bit more spread out than usual. Use your dash ability to catch up to them. Give me a break. Keep an eye out for stray mines in this area. Those silly humans don't seem to care where they drop them. And remember that you can use light bulb bubbles to give you a break from the dark. Grab white bulbs and plank them to keep the light alive. Okay. Good stuff. Feeding frenzy, double frenzy. Nice. Triple frenzy. Ooh, okay. Mm. Super frenzy. Super frenzy. <laughs> okay, gotta grab that. Gotta get the starfish bubbles. I got six lives now, which is nice. Okay, yeah, we gotta avoid getting the things. I think it's just, I think now they're just cycling through all the different fish that we had previously played through. Giving us a couple of regular levels and then a boss battle. It's funny how when you, go, when you play things as a kid, you don't notice certain patterns and level structures. You also don't notice certain imperfections, right? And how certain gameplay is like not as super interesting, it's just sort of more casual and kind of like repetitive stuff, right? But when you're a kid, it just seems a lot more, you know, special, I guess. So, it's kind of funny you overlook things a little more at that age. Uh, but still fun, though. Still enjoy this game even after all these years, believe it or not. Okay, go ahead and chomp this guy real good. Oh, that actually, he actually did give me a little boost. Remember earlier when I was complaining that those guys didn't give you enough of a boost? I stand corrected. They actually gave me quite a bit of one. And like my little meter of like how much we had left to eat, you know? Nice. Would have been funny if he hit a mine when I hit him there. There we go. GG. Your Nighthawk walk me says, and I think I just beat Doom for the 50th time. Really, dude? Dang, that's a lot of times. Congrats, though. What well, Max says, congrats. Oh, I want coffee cake. Oh, I want coffee cake. I would totally go across the street and get coffee cake if it, the store was still open. The Coral Cod is also known as the Tomato Cod. Kill Frenzy? Yeah, instead of feeding Frenzy, it's Kill Frenzy. There you go. 
Checking out the sea, it looks like the intruder's afraid of the dark, or maybe he's just afraid of Eddie. Either way, that means it's time for another glorious bonus stage. No boss fight this time. Grab as many stars as you can in the limited time. We'll have to be quick to snag the white plankton while avoiding the jellyfish. Eat 75 stars in two minutes. Eating frenzy. Ooh. That's, uh... That's, 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 this is... That's kind of hard, guys. It's, it's a little hard. We gotta go eat those guys, even though they like to hang out in the plankton. Double frenzy. Okay, we're, we're making good progress, though. I can't complain. <laughs> this is fun, though. I like levels like this. Little cha gathering stuff challenges. Triple frenzy. Like, as you guys can see, I'm very easily entertained by various different forms of games. I think how much harder this would have been if they'd added mines to it, right? They'd made it so you had to avoid mines while doing this. And with the jellyfish. That would have just been terrible. That would have been way too difficult. I'm glad they didn't make it that way. Okay, 43. We got one minute left. Nice. Nice. Four, we got a light. Nice. 59. 60. Okay. Getting a little antsy here. Mega frenzy. Mega frenzy. Mega frenzy. 40 seconds. Okay, I need three more bubbles, people. One. Two. Last one. Last bloody bubble, let's go. Put over here, Super there you frenzy. go. G stinking G, guys. Murder frenzy, my brain is dead. Mine too, but it's probably just because of what time it is. Mix it up, the intruders made its way to warmer waters and it's up to way with the queen triggerfish to chase it down, but first she has to bulk up for the challenge. The ocean is crowded but unusually deep in this area, so you would, should have plenty of room to avoid predators. Grow, grow, grow. Schools of tasty herring abound in this area. Gobble enough of them, and soon you'll be swallowing tuna and leopard sharks in one gulp. Eat, grow, repeat. All right, and there's treasure at the end, so... Woo, I guess. Yeah, big woo. Uh, I remember playing this as a kid in my father's uh, office computer. At the office where he worked, so... That was fun. Good times. Okay. Oh, what's this dirty little thing? Oh, he got in a little ink cloud. That's what that is. Super frenzy. frenzy bonus. Mega frenzy. Okay, we're almost to medium, believe it or not. We've been eating good over here in these waters. Haven't had any problems with anything? No, we're doing great. Okay. Can't eat the weapon sharks, unfortunately. The killer whales are off limits. Completely. We can't ever eat those. Right now, all we can use is the tuna. Eating frenzy, double frenzy. I can grab hold of some tuna. There frenzy. you go. Minnows are still good, even Super when you got frenzy. tuna on the menu. Mega frenzy. Love all that. Thank you. I, I love the little protective things. Those are very helpful. Nice. I can eat leopard sharks now. Mega frenzy. What is slightly annoying about this is how you get small again after you finish each stage. You know what I mean? Like, obviously, Mega gradually you get uh, big, because the fish that used to be big are now smaller, but, like, from one stage to the next, you're just so Mega small. Frenzy. You know? Must be said, there must be something that's have to say for that. Okay. There we go. GG. <sighs> Anyone else like hardcore mode no just me i like hardcore mode i played saints row in hardcore mode <laughs> each of a fish can be determined by the number of growth rings and its scales cool i think we have like another five or six levels guys pickings are a little slimmer this time around the earring have hightailed it out of here and now the seas are stocked with cuttlefish pufferfish and the dreaded poison fish munch lightly nabbing puffers and cuttlefish take some talent always approach them from the rear and from above or below if possible Avoid green poison fish at all costs. Okay. Let's see. Da, da, da. Nice. Uh, 
Oh. Uh oh. Well, that's sad. Okay. Nice. Eating frenzy. Nice. Double frenzy. Nice. Nice. Triple frenzy. Super frenzy. Oh, come on! We were doing so good, it got all screwed up. Imagine if this was real. I know, right? There's just these fish in this fish community in this concerted effort to find this mysterious intruder. But to do it, to do that, they have to commit, uh, what's it called? Mass genocide and cannibalism on their fellow fish in order to, it's like, in order to make themselves big enough to face down the intruders, like sacrificing the common man for the greater good. You're telling a whole story of war and peace, and pride and morals and ethics, all within a little children's game about fish. Yeah. Just think about that for a moment. Also, I love in this level, the two things that you can eat starting off are Puffer fish and ink squids. That's that's all. Very slim pickings to be sure. Okay. I'm glad we at least made the big guys little for a moment. That's at least nice. Okay. We're almost we're almost uh crap, I am terrible at this. I was about to say we're almost uh to the point where we're at medium and we can start eating big fish. Bigger, I suppose I should say. Hey. Super frenzy. Ooh. I need to be careful, cause I'm trying to look for a smaller fish. Oh, an extra life, sweet, cause I have a tendency to run out of those. Nice. Double frenzy. All right, now I got the medium guys. Perfect. I see you pictures of how tired you look. You're welcome. <laughs> I want to play this game. Really? You like it that much, Willie? That's awesome. Well, um, you can get it on Steam. Or uh, if you like, I can DM you uh, a link. I think it's from like archive.org or something where you can download it. So if you like, you can do that and then you can play it. Okay, and you might be asking yourself, Cass, why didn't you buy it on Steam? If it's on Steam. Uh, it didn't have Steam achievements. Yeah, that's the whole reason. So, yeah. Super friendly. Okay. Got that guy taken care of. Nice. Nice. Okay. Ah, no! Stink, man. We were so close. He's later, see? I ate a poison fish, technically. These later levels can get tricky just because there's so many big guys. And it takes a while to get big yourself and handle everything. We gotta go slow and steady, guys. Gotta keep a careful watching everything. Gotta keep an eye out for the tuna. No crap. Okay, let's try that again. Let's get out of this little shark gathering that we got going on over here. The International Meeting of Sharks, please. Yes, okay. I was so worried he was going to come chomp me, but no, we good. We're Gucci. I'm going to get away from those poisonous ones, not get anywhere near those. They screwed me up so bad. Okay. Nice. Hold up, there you go. Eating frenzy. Nice, okay, go ahead and grab that, thank Double you. Frenzy. Go ahead and grab that, nice. Grab that, grab that. Nice. 
<laughs> okay. Crazy. Sorry I look so tired, guys. The truth is I am tired and I bloody hate these killer whales. I've about had it with these killer whales. Like I am getting very, very frustrated. Like, oh my gosh! What is with the stupid garbage? You and your stupid puffy ink. Yeah. Ah, oh, I hate every one of you. I hope you all rot right now in the bloody ocean. Death be to you all. Okay. Let's try this again because I am not about to lose three lives again. I have to use up my last continue. Not when we've come so close. Eating frenzy. We just need to chill. Be extra careful. Frenzy. This is a tough stage, Queerway, if you can't tell. Just so much stuff to go to be together and go on and everything. My tiredness turning to set and give me a headache. I'm sorry, Lily. I know the feeling. So I'm looking forward to getting some uh, sleep later after we're after we're done with the stream, so that'll be nice. Probably gonna shower first though, I don't smell that great. Your boy Kess needs a shower. Okay, alright, using the clouds for protection, sorta. Okay, well that turned out to be stupid. Okay, there's a tuna, there's another tuna. Avoid the poison thing. Yee, yee. There you go. It's just what I wanted, really. Nice, we made it, guys. We're big. Big shark on campus now. And I guess we're not technically a shark like Goliath, but you know what I mean. We're the big fish. We're gonna. We need the leopard sharks and everything. Take care of them. Oh yeah, there's a whole bunch of it once. We just can't eat the killer whales is the only thing. But that's okay. I think we work away our, our way around that restriction. There we go. GG. We need smelly vision. A TV where you can smell what's happening on screen. Lily, they're actually working on developing that, but I don't I wouldn't want to use that. That sounds terrible. After two satisfying feast, away with the queen triggerfish is ready to face off against the intruder. You need to keep an eye out for poison minnows floating through the battle zone. Yeah, I can see how that would cause problems. Or poison one screwing me up on the bombs. Ah, oh, hell. You've got to be bloody kidding me. That sucks. A lot. Especially with how little lives we have. Let's try that again. Ooh, I almost, I almost got me again. I say nay nay. Oh, I bit his tail. It meant nothing to him, clearly. Okay. Nice. Huh. He sounds like a, a library book card getting scanned. That's what he sounds like. Oh, the minnows kind of screw up my little thing here. By making him just swim away. So is he coming back? I was about to say, it's like, where'd he go? Did he stop for a burger or like, like what's good, yo, you know? Oh, thank goodness we, he, we missed that. Missed getting hit by that, okay. We're good guys, we got this. We totally got this. Like I said, he could have almost uh, sucked that right in there. There we go, GG. Shower for the week. Showering for people who aren't depressed. Oh, what do depressed people do? Do they take baths? Or do they just not bathe? Because if they don't bathe, that's kind of gross. That's kind of gross. The cycle. Uh-oh, way with the queen triggerfish did her part, but the shrunken intruder got away. The alien creature's down, but not out. Even now prepares for its spawning cycle. If it succeeds, it will release billions of microspores to infect all the world's oceans. It will be a disaster. Can Earth be saved? I love how it's an Earth thing now. Is there anyone who can help? Luckily, the world's a champion, a hero who will fight to defend the seas. His name? Boris the Butterfly Fish. Track down the intruder. That's what we need, guys. We need Boris the Butterfly Fish, the movie, okay? Where his only 
food source starting off as a small little fishy was flies, okay? And with those flies, he made fries. That doesn't make any sense at all. I realize that now. I realized it long ago, son. But I was simply not cut out for this line of work. I'm teasing, obviously. Speaking of line of work, I love being a YouTuber. I don't think I don't think I, there could have ever been a more perfect job in the world for me. And I'm not even joking. It's amazing. Okay. Okay, we did it, guys. Now we can get the blue fish. Let's go. Can't eat leopard sharks this time. That's the uneatable fish. The uneatable. That's a weird thing to say. In retrospect. Mega frenzy. Mega frenzy. Mega frenzy. Ooh. Whoops. You got me. There we go. This one's actually not that hard of a level. At least so far it appears to be the case. It's got five lives now, too, which is nice. Makes me have more lives. Mega frenzy. Okay, nice. 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 Mermaid girl coming? There she is. Long time no see, mermaid girl. What's good? What's poppin'? Alright, anyway. Took a shower today. You take baths. Motivation is hard, though. Snowy bat is a survival factor. A team only got one cap this fifth minutes. I'm sorry, Chicken Ward. It's the time of the night where I'm just sad. Sorry. I'm sorry to hear that, Lily. Oh, apparently so is Chicken Ward. Took the words right out of my mouth. Okay, very close now. The approach of the intruder spawning sack was driven local fish life into a frenzy. Oh, they said the name right again. Okay. Barracudas pace angry back and forth as sharks are drawn from far across the ocean, not knowing why. You'll have to brave and nimble to survive in these per turbulent waters. Remember, you're most vulnerable when you're small. Save the heroics for when you've got some muscle mass. Play it safe early on. Grab some stray box fish when you can. Hold out until you grow bigger. Good luck. All right, so this is like the last level, which is one of the hardest ones because there's all these sharks that you can't eat. So many different kinds spread out all over the place with the only one you can eat maybe being the barracuda. So we just got to take our time and grab the little fish, okay? So that's what we got to do. We just got to bide our time, get past this level, and then we have the final boss fight. And then we is done with the story mode. And as for time attack, we'll do that uh, next Saturday. That'll be fun. Frenzy. And grab that. Thank you. Nice. Just gonna go ahead and chill. I'm probably not gonna mess with the Barracuda right now. We got so much going on, you know? You guys know how it be. I think I'm, since I'm being more careful than usual, I'm doing a lot better. Maybe. Oh, that was close. That was very close. Oh, that was close. I had to, like, kind of quickly dart over away. Didn't use my dart ability, though. Probably should have. Nice. No need the medium ones. Let's go. Okay. Grab this. Mega Frenzy. Stay away from the shark. Nice. Mega frenzy. Nice. Sweet. Okay. So we get all the big guys. Just avoid the sharks. Now we can do the heroics. Oh, we're done. There's Mermaid Girl for the last time. Well, not for the last time. We still have time trial. Or no? There's no Mermaid Girl in time trial. I guess that is the last time. Bye forever. My love. No. Okay. Anyway. Da, da, da. It was a dumb map, too. Was it, Chicken Ward? The final battle. Here we go, guys. After a furious swim, Boris discovers the intruder in its lair. Surrounded by hypnotized cuttlefish and dazed poison minnows. The infection cycle is only moments away. Can you stop it in time? 
Use your skill, your knowledge, your judgment, and your courage. All you've learned to defeat the alien intruder and save the Earth. Win. Alright. Here we go, guys. That was a dumb thing to do just now. Nice. Perfect. Very perfect. Okay. We're good. Feeding frenzy. Feeding frenzy. Nice. Not much of a boss battle, is it? It's more or less the same and really not that hard. I do say so myself. Oh, and then he went away forever. Fun, fun. Oh, no, 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 he's actually coming for me now. Oh, no. I guess that was where the bomb was. <laughs> okay, big, big fail. All I am is big, big fail. Nice. Nice, nice. Beautiful. And now we get to actually eat him. Yay. Yum, yum. All right, guys. No more intruder. We saved the world. Woo. All right, food bank bonus. Look, I got, I got the golden trophy, guys. Aren't you proud? All right, Cass Gamer is uh, is yeah, yeah. That's uh, that's that's me, guys. We got top rank of story mode. All right, good stinking stuff. So yeah, that's uh, that's our feeding frenzy two stream for today. I really hope you all enjoyed it. Thank you very much for tuning in. When we come back next Saturday, we'll do time attack mode, and then we'll be done with the feeding frenzy game, so we can move on to something else. Not sure what yet, but we'll figure it out. As for Doom, we'll be back on Monday with some more Wolfenstein Blade of Agony, the final two levels for the campaign in that game. And uh, then we'll be done with that, at least until we go back and do achievements. But we'll do that some other time. And as for Maximum Doom, we've got N levels, so that'll be fun as well. I am kind of half asleep right now. If I seem that way, it's because I am. Big thank you to our T-Squad Plus members who keep us funded and going on a monthly basis. Big thank you to Quinn Knave. Lori T, Mosh Wizards, Alien Force, Lolio Manic, K Plague Doc, Matthias, Real Tide, Shawnee, Bob the Dinosaur, Third Eye, Steve Go Home, Tropical Dark, Bennett Clark, and Regular Gray. That list is growing all the time. I appreciate you guys. Just thank you so much for your help with uh, with just you know kind of the expenses of life. I appreciate you guys. I really do. You make it uh, kind of possible to do all this cool stuff. So yeah, anyway, um, thank you guys again for being here. I look forward to seeing you all this next week for all the cool stuff we got coming. And uh, yeah, you basically had to go medic since there wasn't a situation where you could just slip by that makes sense. Bye everyone, bye fun time, thanks for being here. All right, anyway guys, thank you again for tuning in. Uh, yeah, we'll come back next time, do some time attack. Anyway, till next time, I'll be your host, Kess Gaming, and I'll see you all 